30,000 now. Sholto, 32, 32, thank you, at 32. 32 on this telephone, 35 is the bid, at 35,000. He's out, he's out, 35,000. At 35,000. Any more? At 35, 38,000. Thank you, at 38,000 pounds. Any more? At 38. Adrian's out down here at 38. 40, can I go? 40,000. At 40, FT100, there it is at 40,000, 42,000. 45,000. Any more at 48,000. Now the online bidder, 48,000, it's against you now at 48. Any more? All done? 48,000 pounds then, all done at 48. No more. Thank you. Quite enough there online, but uh, which was after us. 217, GEN 11, GEN 11, of course it was. Chizzy Chizzy Bang Bang, of course. Where can we open this one? 25,000 offered already. 25, 28,000 offered. At 28, at 28. At 28,000 now, at 28. Any more at 28,000? 30,000. At 30 now, at 30. 30,000 pounds. Any more online at 30? 32. 32 I have. 32 I have. Any more? 35 at 35,000. 38 bid in front of me at 38. In the room here at Goodwood at 38, 40,000 bid, 42, at 42,000. Any more online at 42,000, at 42. At 42, Adrian, he's out, 45,000 now at 45, 46,000. We're going once, 47,000, 48,000, 49,000, 50,000. to one. 50,000 bid. Selling all the way at 50,000 bid. Keep to one. Bid's here at 50,000 pounds. Any more? Selling. One anywhere else? At 50,000 pounds. That's yours, Peter. 50,000. Thank you. 709. Oh, love. Last lot. Last lot. W01. So oh, sorry, 218. Beg your pardon, I keep turning two, two sheets here. 6X, my apologies. 6X, lot 218. 6X coming up. The interest coming through. 55,000. The telephones are linked. 55,000. 60,000. 60,000. 65. 65,000 against you here at 65, 6x, at 70,000, he's in first, 75,000, 75,000, 80,000, 80's bid here, 80's bid here, 585, 85, 90,000 here. 6x. 90,000. I'll take two as the next bid, please. 95 online. 95 online. 95 online. Selling all along. Of course. 96,000. Offer 1,000 online. 96 on the telephone. There's our online streaming camera. 96,000 pounds anymore. Online, you want another thousand? 97. Thank you, Richard. 97,000. 98,000. 99,000. 100,000. 101. Light that cigar up in a moment, sir. 
101,000 bid in the room. 101,000 bid in the room. Go to 101, live here at Goodwood. 102,000. Hundred and three, hundred and three thousand. We're keeping to one one hundred and four thousand. Yes, one hundred and five thousand. Selling now at one hundred and six, one hundred and six. Seven, one hundred and seven. 107,000, 108,000, 119, 110, 110,000, 110, next bid's 112, next bid's 112, 110 in the room, 110 in the room, 12, we've got it, 112, so good to see you, 112, see you this evening, £112,000 last chance. The bid is online. 6x5156. 112000 Thank you. Well done online. Now it's the last lot. Right past the moment. James Knight. Lot number 219. W01. W01 in this centenary year of Bentley. Water Owen. Bentley, of course. 219. 219. One sixty, one hundred and sixty thousand, one seventy. Where are the boys from through? One eighty now at one hundred and eighty thousand. One hundred and eighty thousand. Thank you. You'll be at one eighty. I will. One eighty five. But they've gone one ninety straight away. One ninety. One ninety. 190,000, there it is. If you want to go five, you can. At 190,000. All done then? 190. If they want five, let me know now. No? At 190,000 pounds. You all done? 190. We're all done. Sure. Thank you. 190,000, ladies and gentlemen. Well, we're going to commence motor cars in just five minutes, James. Five minutes. Five minutes time. Five minutes time, just to uh, reboot the system. Thank you all very much. There are some reserved seats there for the car session. Just make a note of where you're sitting. Thank you. Thank you. 
<laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, a very warm welcome to you for uh, this edition of the Bonhams Goodwood Festival of Speed sale. My name is James Knight and I'll be your auctioneer for the motor cars. Uh, apologies for starting a little bit late. Uh, we had a power outage and uh, there was a firework fanfare for Malcolm uh, that took up a few minutes as well. Um, just a few... Uh, parish notices to get through before we pick, uh, uh, kick off the sale. First of all, a huge thanks to uh, His Grace uh, the Duke uh, and uh, Gemma Cowan and her team here at Goodwood for allowing us to once again pitch tent on the tapestry lawn. Um, if you are going to be bidding today and there's a car out there of your dreams, you do need to register to bid. The registration desk is behind me. That will enable you to get a bidding paddle and uh, you can then uh, wave it with impunity to me. And uh, if you do purchase a vehicle, that's where you can uh, settle up, or at the very least, get your invoice that will give you the, uh, uh, the total payable plus your, uh, the bank details where to remit the funds. Um, as far as clearance is concerned, all is detailed in your catalogue. Um, we do need to clear this tent tonight to turn it into the Duke's party tent. Um, just let us know, speak to one of the team, if you're successful, what your plans are. We will endeavour to call you as well, but do let us know what your plans are, otherwise we'll be moving them off to uh, store. We do have straight eight logistics here, um, the uh, recommended carrier that we use. Uh, straight eight have a desk up by the document desk, and um, they'll be happy to offer any advice regarding national or indeed international transportation. And indeed Haggerty, uh, our insurance partner, are up there as well, should you wish to add another car to your policy. Um, SRNs, that stands for Sale Room Notices. This is where information has come to light since the publication of the catalogue. Uh, we've put them on each of the windscreens uh, as and when uh, there is an SRN. I will endeavour to read those out. And of course a final reminder that the sale is held in accordance with our conditions of sale as printed in your catalogue. We do have the slideshow working and the currency converter. We've taken the, uh, the rate from earlier today. Uh, it's there for your guidance. Don't regard it as that exact spot rate at that moment in time for you. It will be there or thereabouts. It's for guidance. And, well, finally, busy season ahead for us here at the Bonhams uh, International Team. Uh, we've got our scheduled sales, of course, Quail Lodge in August in California and back to the UK, Bewley at the, auto, uh, the National uh, Motor Museum, the Auto Jumble, and back here for Revival. But we've got more news as well. 
we have been appointed by the state of Geneva to sell a collection of uh, 25 supercars uh, in Geneva at the end of September. Um, and uh, you've got Veyrons and Koenigseggs and all other um, highfalutin uh, modern performance cars and all sold at no reserve. So uh, if you fancy a supercar, that could be the sale for you. And delighted to announce Bonhams MPH. This is a new uh, venture for us here at Bonhams uh, based at Bista Heritage where we will schedule four sales a year of the more modestly priced, the more affordable modern era classics. Uh, delighted that Rob Hubbard here is heading up that uh, venture for us. So uh, more choice, uh, more offerings for you, our customers and clients. So that finishes the uh, parish notices. 301 is not a car. However, it is Philip Porter's unique two-volume uh, book set, 50 Years of Car Design by Gordon Murray. It's going to be a charity lot, uh, Race Against Dementia edition. That's the charity, a one-off for Sir Jackie Stewart, who I'm delighted to say is here um, in the front row uh, to keep an eye on how spirited your bidding is. And um, it's signed by Sir Jackie and uh, Gordon Murray. Uh, comes with a slip case and also there's a unique sketch in the lot as well. So it's a charity lot, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to open the bidding and uh, if it's not strong enough, uh, expect Jackie to give you the evil eye. So, where should we start it, ladies and gentlemen? Where should we start it? Thousand pounds, Rip? Thousand pounds? Thousand pounds, straight in. One thousand I've got. Twelve hundred, thank you. Fifteen hundred I've got. Eighteen, sir? Eighteen hundred bid. Eighteen, two thousand. Over here at two, sir, it's against you. Two, two? Well, it's, yes, two, two. Two thousand, two, with you on the aisle, sir. Two thousand, two hundred pounds. Any advance? Charity lot, unique charity lot, indeed, at two thousand, two hundred pounds. Any more bids? We'll call it now then, shall we, and sell the lot, if there's no further bidding then, at two thousand, two hundred pounds. Fair warning. And going to you. Congratulations, sir. Well done indeed. 375. 375, 2200. Thank you so much indeed. On to, uh, thank you. On to lot two, sorry, 302. Well, not what you'd normally expect for a Festival of Speed sale, but then you don't normally offer a car that was first owned by none other than Frank Sinatra. So it's the Frank Sinatra. Chrysler Le Baron uh, Town and Country Station Wagon, ladies and gentlemen. There it is. There it is. Here at No Reserve. And uh, who will give me £5,000? £5,000? Bless you, sir. Thank you. £5,000. At £5,000. Any advance on £5,000? £5,000. Well, it's the maiden bid. Here to sell. Has to be sold. £5,000. Any more bids? At £5,000. If you want to bid, let it be known. Otherwise, we'll cut it loose and sell for five. The opening offer, the Chrysler Baron Frank Sinatra's. Are we done? Fair warning, you're going. Congratulations, sir. 740. 5,000. Well done indeed. He did it his way. Right, lot number. They don't get any better than that. <laughs> In fact, they'll get a lot worse. Lot 303. Well, ladies and gentlemen, it's the uh, Hutmobile. Uh, well, the Bonhams team have had an enormous amount of fun with the Hutmobile, both on uh, VCC and VSCC events and rallies, and we've spent all the money on it, um, so you don't have to. And yes, we did spend over £50,000, so it really does represent terrific value for money, ladies and gentlemen. It's the Hutmobile, and again... I already have uh, six, seven, eight thousand pounds, I can say. Eight thousand pounds at eight thousand. Eight thousand, nine thousand, your bid, sir. Your Hutmobile at the moment, nine thousand pounds. Ten thousand, ten thousand, ten bid. Thank you, ten. Ten with Malcolm, eleven thousand. Twelve thousand, twelve thousand, here at twelve. Thirteen, fourteen thousand. Fourteen thousand, well, it's still here at fourteen. Any advance at fourteen thousand. Any more bids for the Hutmobile at 14,000? 14,500. 14,500 is bid. 14,500. Well, selling the Hutmobile at 14,500, ladies and gentlemen. Are we all done? Take another 500. 
take another 500, otherwise we're selling the car at 14.5. Fair warning, all done. 14.5, that's your bid, Rob. 5140, thank you. And, uh, well, talking about value for money, I do think these um, 1990s Bentleys look good value. Cost nearly £100,000 when new. Well-maintained example. Bought new and serviced by UK Premier Rolls and Bentley specialists, P and A Wood. So it's the uh, Bentley Brooklands, ladies and gentlemen. And again, who'll get me going? Who'll get me going? 5,000 for it? 5, 10, 10, thank you, Malcolm, saving time. 11, 12, 13, 14, 14, with your bidder, Malcolm, at 14. No reserve, ladies and gentlemen, gotta sell it. 15 with you at the back, sir. 15, with you standing at 15,000. Malcolm's bidder is out at 15,000. Selling the car, any more bids? 15,000 pounds. Are we done then? Are we done? 15. Thousand pounds, fair warning, going. That's your sir, congratulations, 15209. Well done indeed. And uh, on to lot number 305. And scrolling forward nearly 20 years in both Bentley motoring history, here's the 2011 Mulsan. Uh, this is as good as it gets. One owner, less than 30,000 miles, and full. Bentley main dealer service history. These were over 225,000 pounds new. So uh, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, again, very sensibly priced. Already I can open the bidding at uh, 32, 35. I have already at 35, 38, 40, 42, 42, 45. Here at 45, 48, 48,000. Your bid at 48,000. Any advance on 48,000? going at 48,000. Any more bids at 48,000? Any more? 48,000 pounds only. Fair warning. Your bid, 48. Are we done? Are we done at 48,000? Fair warning. If we're done then at 48,000 and going. 48,000. It's yours. Thank you. Got you. Thank you. Lot to lot number. 306, well, it's the 550 Marinello. Uh, please note, car not offered with the uh, books and tools as mentioned in the catalogue. Uh, however, there are copies of the service book on the file. So it's the 550 Marinello, first of the Ferraris today. Comes uh, really very, very well presented. There it is, and again, and again. Here to sell it, ladies and gentlemen. 30,000 for it, 30,000, 30,000. Straight in, 30,000 I have at 30,000, going at 30, 32, 32. Your bid, 32,000. Your bid at 32. Any advance on 32,000, 35,000, thank you. Behind the pillar, 35. In the center, 35, 38,000. 38,000, 40,000. 42, 42 I'm bid at 42,000, 45,000, you're back. At 45,000. 45,000 I have. Your bid at 45,000. Any advance on 45,000. Any more bids at 45,000 pounds. The 550 Marinello at 45,000. Fair warning and going at 45,000. All done, 45. 45,000, not enough on that. Do have a word with us afterwards. And uh, we'll see what we can do for you. Lot number 307, lot 307. One of those classic Mercedes Benzes now, the 220S uh, Ponton. Very rare in right-hand drive, one of only 20 uh, produced. Subject of a long-term restoration program. Uh, interest coming through already. I can open the bidding at 42, 45,000 pounds. I can say at 45,000, 45,000. Going at 45, 48,000, your bid, your bid, 45, 48, 50,000, 50,000, 50,000, 52, 55, 55, I'm bid at 55,000, any advance on 55,000? Well, selling the car, 55,000, any more bids at 55,000 pounds? 
the 220S, selling all the way then, 55,000. Are we done? And going, 55,000 it is, uh, 706, thank you, uh, 55,000. Lot number 308, 308, thank you, Georgia. Well, it's the Citroen, isn't it? There it is. There it is, rather nice Citroen DS23. Got the five-speed manual box and also restored a few years ago, again at uh, no reserve. And uh, already I can open the bidding at uh, seven, eight thousand pounds. I've got eight thousand, nine thousand, ten here, eleven, twelve, thirteen. My book's clear. It's with you, sir. At thirteen thousand, any advance on thirteen thousand pounds? Selling the Citroen. Any more bids at £13,000, here to be sold, here to be sold then at 13000 Are we done then? No reserve car at £13,000, 14000 I wouldn't let him get away with that, sir. 14000 No. Your press release said brave bidding. At uh, £14,000 then, second row, second row bidder. Always spots a bargain at fourteen thousand pounds in going. Are we done? Fair warning at four. Where's fifteen thousand? New bidder, sir. New bidder. Sixteen. Second row against the fourth row. Sixteen thousand. Well, thank you anyway, sir. Sixteen thousand. Still with the second row. Sixteen thousand pounds. Are we done then? Selling the car at sixteen. And sold at 16,000. First of many today, 381. Well done indeed. <laughs> well done indeed. Lot number 309, another one of those uh, sale room notices that I uh, mentioned in the, uh, uh, the notes to begin with. Please note the engine of this uh, Mini is numbered 9FSAH20049, as such, believed to be the original matching numbers unit. Uh, please note, uh, the car is offered with a copy of the UK V5 document and the original German registration document. So all within the EU, and um, you've got the old uh, UK number to work with. Great little mini here, recreation of the Monte Carlo uh, car, where they performed so admirably, offered with its fever identity papers too. So, again, £20,000, let's get going at £20,000, folks. 20000 20,000 bid, your bid at 20,000, your mini at 20,000. Any advance on 20, 20, 22, 22,000. 22, I've got 25,000. It's against you, sir. Against you, 28,000. 28,000, 30,000. 30,000, I've got at 30,000. Well, thank you anyway, your bid at 30,000. Any advance on 30? Any advance on 30? 30,000, 32, 32. New bid are seated, sir. New bit of seated, 32,000. 32,000. 33, why not? 33,000. 33, 34. 34,000. Well, at 34,000. Bids here at 34,000. Any advance? Take another thousand. Take another thousand. Otherwise, we'll let the mini go at 34,000. Fair warning. Going at 34,000, 34,000, thank you. Lot number 310 is withdrawn. We hope to see it uh, later in the year, probably at Bewley, I would uh, guess. So lot number 311, 311, uh, advised by the vendor, this BMW is matching numbers example and uh, the mileage of 41,600 uh, as warranted by the previous owner. Uh, the MOT has been renewed with no advisory and expires in June 2020. So you've got a fresh, uh, fresh MOT with it. It's the, uh, the BMW CS. Oh, they're becoming more and more appreciated, and rightly so. Here's a very rare example. Uh, Right-hand drive, manual transmission, and with the city pack, which is electric sunroof and electric uh, windows, power steering too. As I say, being the subject of that major restoration, uh, period uh, correct uh, tiger green livery, which is uh, absolutely from the era, isn't it? 1970s, purples, browns, and greens. So, ladies and gentlemen, we already have 
42, 45,000 offered for it, 45,000 here at 45,000, here at 45, 48,000, 50 with my absentee, at 50,000, 50,000, 55,000, 55, in the room at 55,000, any advance on 55,000 pounds, going at 55, 55,000, any more, 8, 58,000, new bidder, 58,000, 60 next if you wish sir, 58 is bid, 60 next, 60,000. Two if you wish, sir. I've got 60,000. Take two. Otherwise, the bid is here at 60,000. 62 anywhere at 60,000. Any more bids at 60,000? 60, 62,000. Back in. Back in at 62,000. Well, thank you anyway. 62,000 I have. Any more bids now at 62,000? Any more bids? I'm going, are we done? 62,000. 62 it is. Thank you. Lot number 312. Well, I must say, when going through the catalogue, can you give it to me on the, near the time? Uh, lot number 312. Well, going through the catalogue, the. Uh, I must say, a huge variety of cars we've got for you, and this MG really exemplifies that. A truly historic British competition car, winner of the 1934 RAC TT in the hands of TT winning motorcyclist Charlie Dodson, regarded as the best handling of the pre-war uh, competition MGs, and it really is a great pre-war race and rally car. Bit of interest, as you would suspect, and I'm already opening the offers at 100,000. 100,000 I have at 100,000. 110,000 pounds. Your bid. 110,000 I have at 110. 110. 120,000. 120 I'm bid at 120,000. 130,000. On the left against you on the right. 130,000. 130,000. Well, it's your bid, sir. Your bid. 130,000. Any advance at 130,000. 140,000. 140,000, 150,000, 150,000. Well, it's between you both, ladies and gentlemen. 150,000. At 150,000, going at 150,000. Any more bids at 150,000, 160,000, 160,000. It's a new bidder against you both, 160,000. 160,000. Well, we'll sell the car if there's no further bids. I'll take two from either of you. Otherwise, I'm selling the car for 160,000. Fair warning. Good to see you, by the way. 160,000. 162. 65, sir. 165. 165 with you, Charlie, at 165,000. Fair warning and going. Well done. John, you're frightening me. They're out. 165 then. Charlie, well played indeed. Do you have a number, sir? 737. I'll match your Boeing. Good to see you, Poppy. Lot number. Lot number 314. Well, it's this uh, rather nice, charming, one and a half litre long chassis, Aston Martin. It's the Le Mans, ladies and gentlemen. That's the model to have, the Aston Martin Le Mans. And uh, offered, sadly, from a deceased estate. That's the only reason why it's uh, coming to market. 1933 car. And again, interest coming through. I've already got uh, 75, 80, 85,000 bid here at 85,000. 85,000, 90,000. 90,000, 95,000, at 95,000, 95, 95, 100,000, good to see you, 100 bid here, nearer me, 100,000, 100,000, the bid is here, your bid sir, 100,000, any advance, 110, 110, <laughs> it's my job sir, <laughs> 120, 120,000, 
Still near with me. 120,000 is bid. At 120,000. Any advance at 120,000. Selling the car at 120,000. 120,000. Going to be sold, ladies and gentlemen. It's the only one today, Shane. At 120,000. Are we all done? At 120,000. Here and selling. All done at 120. You got it, sir. Congratulations. Well played indeed. 505. Great to see you. And on to lot number 315. Lot 315. Well, ladies and gentlemen, there it is showing on my left near the uh, rostrum. There it is. One of only 14 uh, petrol electric hybrid McLaren experimental prototype P1s built, capable of accelerating to 60 in 2.8 seconds and electronically limited to 217 miles an hour, uh, just in case you wanted to go faster than that. Uh, this like new P1 uh, was the New York Motor Show and Geneva Salon show car, having only covered approximately 340 miles with its international motor show history and key role in the development of McLaren's iconic hypercar, this stunning P1 is a must-have for any serious collector. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. As you can imagine, significant motor car, and we can commence the bidding at £900,000. At £900,000 for the P1. At £900,000. Any advance? At £900,000. £900,000 I've got. £950,000. Your bid, £950,000. Next is one million, 950,000. Who wishes to bid the million at 950,000? One million, thank you, I have, at one million pounds. One million pounds. Well, keep it in 50s if you wish. Keep it in 50s if you wish. One million, I have the bids here at one million. Yes? And 50. One million and 50, I've got. One million, 100,000 is next. I've got one million and 50,000. It's your bid, sir. One million and fifty thousand. It's against you, sir. At one million and fifty thousand. Any advance? One million and fifty thousand. One million one hundred thousand. One million one hundred thousand. Well, you will miss it. I've got one million one hundred thousand is the bid. Any advance at 1,100,000. Any more bids at 1,100,000. Take another 50, sir, or indeed anywhere else. But the bids here at 1,100,000. Are you sure? You're sure. 1,100,000 then. Are we done? Last time of asking then at 1,100,000. Fair warning. 1,100,000. Thank you very much indeed. 1,100,000. And thank you. On to lot number 316. Lot 316. Well, I'm a big fan of the early two litre Bristols. Big fan of the early two litre Bristols where aero engineering technology uh, was adopted. Uh, they're a joy to drive. Good performance, superb handling. This is a particularly well-maintained example of the 611 uh, built. And interest coming through already. I've got 25,000 for it. 25,000. 25,000. Good collector's cars at 25,000. Any advance on 25,000? 25. The bid is here at 25. 28,000. Your bid. Towards the back seated. 28,000 I have at 28,000. Seated bidder. 28,000. 30,000. All in the seats. 30,000. Your bid. 30. 30. 32,000. 32, I've got at 32,000. On my right, 32,000. Going at 32,000. Any more bids now at 32,000? Are we done? Here at 32. Any more bids? For the Bristol at 32,000. Fair warning. Going. 32,000, not enough for that. We'll pass that lot and we move on 
to lot number 317. It's the, uh, uh, the Swallow Duretti, another rarely seen British car, hardly surprising uh, with just 276 uh, built. Uh, the Swallow Duretti that utilized the sprightly Triumph uh, TR2 engine and uh, running gear. Interest uh, coming through, and I can open the bidding here at 20. Six thousand pounds, twenty-six thousand at twenty-six thousand. Interest here at twenty-six thousand, twenty-six, twenty-eight with you in the room at twenty-eight thousand, thirty thousand. Back here at thirty thousand, thirty-two thousand, thirty-two thousand. Well, it's in the room at thirty-two thousand, going at thirty-two thousand. Holding for online if you wish, but I've got thirty-two thousand in the room at thirty-two thousand, thirty-two, thirty-four, thirty-four thousand. 34, it's against you, sir, 34,000. It's against you. 36, 36 I have at 36,000. Well, on the right, against you on the left, 36,000. The Swallow Duretti, any more bids? Find me another at 36,000 pounds. Any more bids now? Are we done? 36,000 and going. Are we done? 36,000. Thank you, lot uh, number 318, lot 318. And uh, again, interest coming through, it's the Delahaye Legend. Very rare and pretty three position drop head coupe by Pennock. Uh, this 135M really does present beautifully restored example. Fully recommissioned, having been unused since completion, running and driving beautifully. Uh, the Delahaye is indeed ready to enjoy. So, ladies and gentlemen, where should we start it? 140,000 for it? 140,000? 140,000. 140 bid. Thank you. Your bid at 140,000. Well, at 140,000. Going at 140. Any advance at 140,000. 150,000. 150, I'm bid. 160,000, 160, 160, 170, 170, don't stop now, sir, 170,000, 180,000, 180,000, further back, it's against you nearer me, 180,000, 180, take five if you like, I've got 180, I'll take five, 185,000. 185,000, 190,000, 190,000 I have, but 190,000, well any more bids now, 190,000, are we done, at 190,000, fair warning, 190, online anymore, no, at 190,000 then, 190,000, not quite there on that, let's move on, to lot number 319. Well, this is a car that's uh, enjoyed a lot of viewing, actually, over the viewing period. A lot of people admiring the car, opening the uh, history file and uh, getting out the keys. Uh, seekers rarely come to market because, well, quite simply, owners don't want to sell them. Uh, this example has been in the care and custody of the same family since 1978. Uh, that's a little over 40 years. As lovely an example and uh, that's been well viewed as I say. So ladies and gentlemen, again, I can open the bidding already, saving time. I've got 60,000 already for it. 60,000, 60,000, 65,000. Thank you straight in at 65,000. 65,000 I have at 65,000. 65, any more bids at 65,000? Going at 65, 65, 70,000, 70,000, 70,000, 75,000. 75,000. The bids are here. Telephones are waiting to come in. They're in. 80,000. 80,000. Well, it's with the telephone. It's against you both. 80,000. There's the bid on the phone. 80,000. Any advance on 80? Any more bids then? At 80,000, with your bidder, John, with your bidder, 80,000. Going then at 80, any more bids at 80,000 for the Aseka, fair warning. Your bar, John. 
5041, thank you, 80,000. Lot number 320. Lot 320. There it is, ladies and gentlemen, the uh, 1998 XJ220. Well, the words supercar and sensational are often to be found in conjunction and no more justifiably so than in the case of the Jaguar's fabulous XJ220. Delivered by Jaguar Sport in November 1993 to Reg Vardy PLC. Hello, sir. Good to see you. Uh, it was first registered in 1998. Uh, it's been, uh, with its current fastidious owner for 10 years and been regularly maintained and serviced by either Jaguar Browns Lane or indeed the Mark Specialist Don Law with no expense spared. Its last engine out service took place only 800 miles ago and new Bridgestone fires were fitted just 250 miles ago. It's finished in the best color combination of spa silver with smoke gray, leather trim and only been driven for 9,350 miles from new. Who's here to be the next owner of this rare and iconic XJ220. So, ladies and gentlemen, I already have £260,000 for the car. £260,000. Any advance at £260,000. £260,000. The bid's here at £260,000. £280,000 I have. £280,000 I have. £300,000. £300,000 I've got. £300,000. £320,000. New bidder. New bidder here. £320,000. £320,000. £340,000. 360,000 at 360,000. Well, it's nearer me, 360,000. Any advance at 360,000. Selling the car all the way at 360,000. I take 10 for me, the you gentlemen. Otherwise, we're cutting her loose at 360,000. Take another 10 for me, the you gentlemen, or indeed anyone else. 360,000. Otherwise, we sell the car then at 360,000. Are we all done? Congratulations, sir. 244, 360,000. 244, 360. On to uh, lot number 321. 321. And, uh, well, again, it's the Porsche. European-delivered uh, example that was once owned by none other than uh, Willie Cowson. Uh, a Porsche factory driver well known to us all for his spirited drives in the legendary 908s and 917s in period. Furthermore, and indeed most importantly, the car was restored by his skilled mechanics in his workshop in 2015. It's beautifully presented and comes with that great provenance, ladies and gentlemen. It's the 356 rally car. Uh, phones coming through and again already Already we can open the bidding at 50,000 for it, 50,000, 50, 55, thank you, straight in, your bid at 55,000, 55, 60, nearer me at 60,000, 60 seated, 65,000, 65 standing, 65 standing, 70,000, 70,000, well it's nearer me, seated at 70, any advance at 70,000, 75,000, 75,000. 80,000. 80,000 I've got at 85,000. 80,000. 80, Going at 80. Any more bids? 85,000. 85,000. Well, it's with the telephone at 85,000. Any more bids? Telephone has it. 85,000. Any more bids now at 85,000? Are we done? Sell the car then at 85. There's no further bids then. 85,000 and going. Your bit of Tim, 85,000. 5087, thank you. And on to lot number 322. Lot 322. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, it's the Gordon Keeble uh, offered for you. Number 21 of just 99. Built, very rare car, highly sought after, and uh, why wouldn't it be with that perfect blend of US power, Italian styling, and British chassis? One of those might have been British GT cars, uh, were they not so expensive in period? They really were 
very much a luxury car in period. And again, here to sell it, ladies and gentlemen. Here to sell it. Already I can open the bidding at uh, 35,000 foot, 35,000 at 35,000 for the Gordon Keeble at 35,000, 38,000. Thank you, bid. Yours at 38,000. Going at 38,000. 40,000. 40,000. 40,000. 40,000. Your bid at 40,000. Any advance on 40? 40,000. 42,000. 45,000. 45,000 bid at 45,000. 45,000 is bid. 45,000. Any advance at 45,000. Any more bids at 45,000. 45,000. Well, we're selling the car. 45,000. The car is on sale, ladies and gentlemen, at 45,000. Try a crafty bid if you like, otherwise we're selling the car at 45,000. Fair warning. Are we done at 45,000? It is being sold. Congratulations at 45,000, 5013, 45,000. Thank you. On to lot number 323, lot 323. Well, ladies and gentlemen, one of the undoubted stars of today's sale, the magnificent Alfa Romeo 8C 2300. This beautifully presented example uh, retains its original engine to chassis and is offered for sale from a prominent UK connoisseur collector Upon acquisition some 12 years ago, the 8C was immediately sent to Mark Specialists, uh, Jim Stokes Workshops, and Neil Twyman to ensure perfect working order. Quite simply, it is ultim the ultimate pre-war car, wonderful 8C, on the button, and ready for touring and the season ahead. Well, ladies and gentlemen, as you'd expect, we do have interest, and I can open the bidding at... £2,500,000 at £2,500,000 at £2,500,000 I have at two million five. any advance at £2,500,000 £2,600,000 your bid sir £2,600,000 any advance your bid two million six. any advance on two million six. Two million seven. Two million seven. it's against you sir two million eight. Two million eight hundred thousand. I've got still seated, still against you standing. Two million eight hundred thousand. Two million nine hundred thousand. Two million nine hundred thousand. Don't lose it just yet, sir. Two million nine hundred thousand. Three million bid at three million. They're just numbers, sir, not barriers. Three million. Three million pounds at three million one. Three million one hundred thousand. Three million one hundred thousand. Three million one. Three million two hundred thousand. At three million two hundred thousand. You sure? Well, thank you anyway. You've been the sport. 3,200,000 with you, sir, on my right. Let me know if you want to come back, sir. But I'm at 3,200,000. Any advance? At 3,200,000 pounds, I'm bid. Any more bids? At 3,200,000. With you seated. Still against you standing, sir. And against the rest of the room at 3,200,000. Any advance? Take 50 if you like, sir. Don't lose it for 50. Another 50,000 if you wish. You've come so far. 3,250,000. Same for you, sir. Thank you very much. Same for you. 3,250,000. Three million three if you wish. Three 
three million three hundred thousand. Three million three hundred thousand. It's still against you standing, sir, at three million three hundred thousand pounds. Any more bids now? Take another fifty. Take another fifty. At three million three hundred thousand. Fair warning. Are we done then? Bid now, forever hold your peace, sir. At three million three hundred thousand. Fair warning. Are we done? Three million three hundred thousand. Well done indeed, sir. Three million three hundred thousand. Three, two, four. Next. Thank you. On to next lot now. Then Porsche. Back to Porsche now. Back to Porsche. Well done. Back to Porsche. The uh, lot three, two, four, nine, eleven. I must say, I'm a big fan of these early nine elevens. Uh, the simplicity of design, uncluttered by wings, flares, and spoilers. A rare right-hand drive. Deluxe version, beautifully restored by Heritage Motorworks. Uh, what more could you want? So, ladies and gentlemen, where should we start it? Where should we start it? I can start at uh, 90, 95,000. I can say it, 95,000, 95,000, 95. Here at 95, 100,000 bid. Thank you. Your bid, 100, 100,000, 100,000. Here at 100 now. 105, why not? Keep it in fives, 105. 10 is next. 10 is next, 110,000, 110,000. Your bid at 110, 110. Any more bids, 110 I've got. Going at 110, 110, 115, new bidder. It's a new bidder, sir, 115,000. Next is 120, I've got 115. Any more bids now, 115,000 pounds. Take another five, take another five at 115,000. Are we done? 115, uh, not enough. We'll pass that lot, ladies and gentlemen. And on to lot number 325. Lot 325. Well, it's a 200, 2006 Defender having received the Mastora Magic to Renovatio specification. Note that registration number two. Uh, it's a Mastora. Uh, the upgrades are truly extensive and as outlined in the catalogue. It looks like it has every option available. What a car, and here at no reserve. So, ladies and gentlemen, and, uh, well, let's get it sold. 10,000, I have already at 10,000. Any advance, it's no reserve. 10,000, 10,000, 15, 20, 20,000 I've got at 20,000. Selling all the way, it's no reserve at 20,000. I can't believe it, 20,000. Looks good value at that, doesn't it? 20,000. Any more bids? 25,000. 25,000. Nearer me, 25,000. I can't believe it. I've got to sell it. It's no reserve. Seems like a bargain to me at 25,000. Are we done? Are we done at 25,000? Selling the car at 25,000 and going. Fair warning now. Are you bidding right at the back? 30,000. Sorry about that, sir. 30,000. 30,000 right at the back. If you win it, I'll get an eye test reading your paddle at 30,000. No reserve. 30,000. Any more bids? Any more bids? Selling the car at 30. 30,000. Do you want a little one? No? Well, thank you anyway. 30,000. Selling the car and going at the back. 30,000. That's your car. And the number, sir? 246. Yep. Yeah. 246. Like your Dino. 30. Thousand pounds, two, four, six. Thank you. Lot number three hundred and twenty-six. Lot three twenty-six. Well, I must say, the Integral Evo Two is one of the best in class. Number seventy-eight of only one hundred and eighty built, regularly uh, maintained, and well looked after. Very original with good uh, history. Uh, file and servicing by a mark uh, specialist. Thank you. So, ladies and gentlemen, it's the Lancia Delta uh, Integrale 
Uh, interest uh, coming through already, and I can open the bidding at 45, 50. Thousand pounds, I can say fifty thousand pounds, fifty, fifty-five thousand, fifty-five thousand. I've got fifty-five thousand, sixty thousand, sixty thousand, sixty bid, sixty bid. It's against you. Sixty thousand, I've got it. Sixty thousand, sixty-five thousand, sixty-five. Here at sixty-five, you won't find a better one, sir. Sixty-five, seventy thousand, seventy thousand at seventy. On my right, against you on the left, seventy thousand. I'm bid at seventy thousand. Going at 70. Any more bids at 70,000? Well, it looks like it's yours at 70,000. Any more at 70,000? 70, 70,000. Little one? 72. Little one here. He took the little one at 72,000. Selling the car, ladies and gentlemen. It's going to be sold at 72,000 pounds. Any more bids now at 72,000 pounds? We're here, we're selling. If there's no better bid, another one, sir. Got to sell it. It's here at 72. You sure? 72,000. Your bid of Rupert, 72,000. Fair warning. And going at 72,000. Your bid of Rupert. 5104. Thank you very much indeed. Lot number. Lot numbers. 327. Lot 327. Well, at the heart of the SLR is the 5.5-litre, 24-valve, supercharged V8, delivering just the 617 brake horsepower. One of the most powerful engines in a series-produced uh, road-going car. This fabulous example was supplied new and maintained by uh, the SLR Centre at Brooklands. There it is, ladies and gentlemen, showing for you on the screen. Does look the business, doesn't it? Does look the business. And, well, I've already got 100,000 offered for it. 100,000, 100,000 bid. Thank you, 100,000, 100,000. Going at 100, 110,000, nearer me seated. 110,000, 120,000. 120, 130,000. Nearer me seated. You can see the bids, 140. 150,000 is bid. 150,000, any advance at 150. 150,000. Seated against you standing, sir. 150,000. Well, we're here. We're selling it. 150,000. Going to be sold. Take another five for you, sir, if it helps. But I'm at 150,000. Otherwise, I'm selling the car. Could be yours at 150,000. If there's no further bids, I'll be done at 150. Congratulations. 150. Well done indeed. Well done, well done. After the pleasure comes pain, sir. Can I have your paddle number? <laughs> 749, 749, thank you. 150,000. Well done, you'll enjoy ownership of that. And, uh, oh, where am I going? And I must say, I would very much like to experience ownership of the next car as well. Very much one of my favorites, the big Healy, the works Healy. And uh, here's a pretty special one for you, ladies and gentlemen. There it is. It's uh, SMO 93B. One of four works Austin Healey 3000 Mark III's prepared by the factory for the 1964 season. And the winner of the 1964 Spa Sophia Liège rally, driven by, uh, to victory by the great Rano Altonen who is actually here this weekend. Offered from a prominent private collection, this works Healy benefited from regular servicing and maintenance by pretty much the best in the industry, Woolmer Classic Engineering, the leading authority on Healy's. Very rare opportunity to, to acquire a genuine works car. As we know, no collection is complete without one. Interest coming through already, and I've already got £140,000 bid for it. 140000 140,000, 150,000 your bid, sir. 150,000, 150 I have at 150,000, 160,000. Genuine works, Healy, 160,000, 170,000, 170,000. Any advance at 170,000, it's your bid, 170. 180,000, 180,000 is bid. On the telephone, 180, 190, 190, 
back in the room, your bid against the phone, 190,000. Going at 190 now, 200,000, 200,000. Well, it's a magnificent car. Don't miss it. Don't miss it. Take another 10 if you like. Take another 10 if you like. Otherwise, we'll sell the car for 200,000 to the telephone. At 200,000, any more bids? Genuine works, Healy. A lot of fun at 200,000 and going. All done. 200,000, that's your bit of Richard. 5107, staying in the UK, gone into a great stable. And uh, I did say I look forward to uh, co-driving it uh, with them. So uh, I'll hold them to that. Lot number 329, well, back to Munich. The BMW 3-litre CSL. It's a rare right-hand drive model, first registered to Lord Astor, no less, and benefiting from a major overhaul and restoration in the late 1990s. Mechanical work carried out by Mark Specialist's Munich Legends. Uh, comes with uh, air conditioning and the five-speed close ratio uh, dog leg uh, gearbox. And uh, well, ladies and gentlemen, so pretty special. Three liter BMW now, where should we start it? Where should we start it? 50,000 for it, 50,000? 50, 50,000 opening at 50, any of us at 50,000? 50,000? 50,000 bid, thank you, up by the Bentley at 50,000. 50,000 I have at 50,000, any advance? Well, it's your bid, sir, 50, going at 55, 55. 60, 60,000, 65,000. 70, 70,000. Well, it's your bid still standing, sir, against you seated. 70,000 with you, sir, at 70. 70,000. Any advance on 70? Any advance on 70,000? Any more bids at 70? Any more bids now? 70,000 for the BMW. No more, 70,000. Well, we'll let that go. That can live to fight another day, 70,000. Moving on to uh, lot number 330. Lot 330. Well, I'm a big fan of the Feltham Astons and this 24 Mark I is a particularly nice example. As you can see, highly original. So much so it was entered into last year's preservation class at Salon Privé. So ladies and gentlemen, where should we start this? Very nice DB24 Mark I. And again, 70,000 gets me going at 70,000. 70,000, 75,000. Good to see you, sir. 75,000, 75, 80,000. 80,000, 80,000. 85,000, new bidder at 85,000. 85 I have, going at 85,000 only. Seems cheap at that, doesn't it? 85, 90,000, 90,000. Up by the alpha at 90,000, 90,000. 95,000 online, online hazard at 95,000. 95,000, 100,000, 100,000. Against you online, 100 back in the room. 110 online, I've got your bid, 110,000. Online has it. It's against you in the room, sir. 110,000. Sell the car, shall we? It's 110,000. 120,000. 120,000. I was looking for you, sir. Now I can see you. 130,000. Online against you, sir. 130. The dollar is very strong. 140,000. 140. 140,000. Back in the room. Back in the room. Could be heading to the States. Save it for the nation. 140,000. But 140,000 I'm bid. Any advance at 140,000 online. Say we'll take 145 if it helps them. If it's uh, a little bit difficult, let's try. Next is 145 online if you want. Otherwise, we're selling it for 140. To you, sir, 140,000. Take another five. Otherwise, we're selling at 140. Fair warning, then. 509. Congratulations, Stephen. 140,000. 509. And uh, thank you indeed. Lot number 331. Lot 331. 
Well, ladies and gentlemen, another interesting car we've got for you today, Lot 331. Uh, really the result of the Vendor's obsessive uh, quest to own a truly real GT40. This built to the most accurate and exacting period specification possible using many original GT40 components. Stunning and highly eligible GT40 has fresh FIA HTP papers and best of all it's UK road registered ladies and gentlemen. Well we're here to sell this car today ladies and gentlemen. We're here to sell the car. I can open the bidding at £400,000. £400,000. It's worth a lot more than that ladies and gentlemen but we can open the bidding at 400000 400,000. In advance, at 400,000, we have 400,000. 420,000. Your bid, sir. 420,000 and going at 420,000. Live at 420,000. 450,000. 450. Yes? Yes, 450 I have at 450,000. 480,000. 500,000. Bar six hours beckons. Five hundred thousand is bid at five hundred thousand. Keep it small if you like. Another twenty if you wish. I'm at five hundred thousand. With the HTP papers at five hundred thousand. Five hundred twenty thousand. Road registered. Five hundred twenty thousand. Couldn't build it for that, sir. 520,000. At 520,000. There's the bid. Any advance at 520,000. Take another bid. Take another bid at 520,000. Only are we done. Fair warning at 520. 520. Now that's not quite there, sir. Do have a word with us after. First past the post with this car. Seller is very committed to sell. 520,000. Thank you. Lot number 332. Lot 332. Well, again, another car here to be sold. The Bentley 4.5 litre. Wonderful 4.5 litre Bentley is offered with its matching numbers. Engine and gearbox fitted with an original VDP body. Presented with unusually well documented ownership history from new. This example has been restored and maintained by the Premier Mark specialists regardless of cost. Most interestingly and importantly the car is accompanied with an illustrated report by Claire Hay confirming its racing shop special features uh, that actually stem from a history important six month stint literally as old mother gun. So ladies and gentlemen the four and a half litre Bentley, it's absolutely what you want. VDP Touring on the four and a half litre chassis. Again, we're here to sell and I can open the bidding at 300,000 pounds, at 300,000. Genuine four and a half litre Bentley at 300,000 pounds, at 300,000. Any advance at 300,000. 320,000 bid at 320,000. Here to be sold. It's your bid, 320,000. Going 350,000. I've got the bid, thank you, 350,000. Your bid, sir, 350,000, 380,000. 380,000 I have at 380,000. Any advance? I cannot believe it, 380,000. This is good value at 380,000. Any more bids at 380,000? Fair warning. 380 going at 380,000. Three what? 385. 385,000 bid. Thank you at 385,000. Well, they all count, as they say. 385,000. 385,000. Well, ladies and gentlemen, it's hard to believe, but the car is selling at 385,000. 
you won't find a cheaper four and a half litre Bentley for sale this year at 385,000. We are selling. 390? 390. Good to see you, sir. 390, especially when you're bidding. 390. No? 390 with you. 390. Great to see you, by the way. 390,000. Well, it is selling, ladies and gentlemen. I cannot believe it. I cannot believe it. We are selling the car at 390,000 if there is no further bids. Are we done? Have to be sure. This is almost theft down here. Congratulations at 390,000. 395. 395. 400. 400. Another five, sir? 400,000. It's here. It's selling at 400,000. I cannot believe it, but there you go. We're here to sell them. And we have. Congratulations. 400,000. Well done. And uh, Arturo, do you have a number? No. Okay. Arturo Keller, lovely to see you. Mrs. Keller, great to see you. And on to the next lot. On to the next lot, lot 333. Three. The fully restored. 1960. Bentley S2, one of only 222. You've done very well. You're going to keep it in the UK. Let, we'll look after it. We'll play with it for you. Keep it exercised. 529, by the way. 529. Yep, 529. Thank you very much. So, okay, lot 333. It's the Bentley, ladies and gentlemen. I'm sticking to the Bentley theme. Only 222 HJ Mulliner S2 Continentals built. This lovely example has been sub uh, subject to a complete nut and bolt restoration to the excellent condition you see before you today. Some 120,000 spent on the rebuild offered from a prominent private UK collection where it resides alongside some of the world's most important cars. This beautiful Tudor grey, which is the colour to have S2, is in show condition, ready for the season ahead. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen, look at that. That's for you, coming up now. One hundred and forty thousand pounds we can save. One hundred and forty thousand. One hundred and forty thousand. One hundred yes, one fifty bid. One fifty. It's your S2 at the moment, sir. One hundred and fifty thousand. One sixty thousand. One sixty. One seventy. One hundred and seventy thousand. One hundred and seventy thousand. Going at one hundred and seventy thousand. Any advance at one hundred and seventy thousand. One hundred and eighty thousand. New bidder, one eighty. One eighty I have at one hundred and eighty. 180, 180,000. It's your bid, sir. 180 and going. The Bentley S2, 180,000. Any more bids? 180,000. I cannot believe it. Another good value car. 185, 185, 190, 190, 190. 190,009 bid. Still against you, sir. Going at 190. Take another five. Take another five. You will miss it, sir. 190,000 and going. Fair warning. Are we done at 190? 190 it is. Thank you. We'll pass that. Moving on to lot number 334. Lot 334. Well, it's the uh, 250 GT. One of the most elegant coupes of the uh, 1960s, delivered new to Italy, where else? With engine numbers checked and verified by Ferrari. Truly stunning order, ready to delight its new owner, the 250 GT, the Pininfarina Coupe, or the PF Coupe as it's known as well. And again, and again, I've already got 300, 300,000 pounds for it at 300,000. 300,000, there it is just by the back of the chairs at 300,000. Any advance on three? Three, I'm bid. 320, yes, yes, 320,000. Good to see you, 320,000, especially when you're bidding. 320,000, 320, 340, 340 I've got. 360, 360. Well, it's your bid, your bid, 360,000. You will miss it, sir, 360,000. Going at 380. 380, they're back. They're back at 380. They're back at 380. Take 10 if it helps you, sir, but I'm at 380. 
Take another 10. No? Well, thank you anyway. 380,000 pounds. Take another 10,000. Otherwise, we'll let her go at 380,000. Are we done at 380? 380,000. Thank you. And uh, same as the last lot. Number 335. Well, I must say, this is a very, very elegant car. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. The Rolls Royce Silver Ghost. Shipped, well, it's a Derby built ghost and it was shipped to Rolls Royce of America in New York and delivered to its first owner, Mrs. W.K. of the Vanderbilt uh, dynasty. In the 1990s, the car returned home, if you like, to the UK for restoration and a new sporting London to Edinburgh open touring body. All works completed by the best in the business. Uh, since then, been looked after by uh, Alan Glue Limited and the National Motor Museum down at Bewley have also looked after the car. A stunning sporting ghost with impeccable ownership provenance, ladies and gentlemen. Well, interest coming through, and I already have £160,000 bid for the car. Already have £160,000. 160000 170000 Good to see you, sir. 170, 180. 180. Your bid at 180. 190. 190. 190. 200. 200, I'm bid at 200,000. Is bid at 200,000. Any advance at 200,000. Take another 10. Take another 10. I'm at 200,000. There's the bid at 200,000. Take another 10. I'm at 200,000. Any more bids? Vanderbilt family owned. When new. At 200,000 pounds bid. Any advance now? 200,000. Are we done? At 200,000. We're bid at 200,000. Any more now? Well, we'll call it now at 200,000. Selling the car at 200,000. Will be sold at 200, either? No, 200,000. Selling all the way. 200, we're bid and selling. 200,000 it is, 50, 90, thank you sir, you're going to enjoy that, beautiful car, 200,000, on to lot number 336, lot 336, well we've got some cracking cars for you today ladies and gentlemen, and this is another particular favourite of mine, it's the car that I would reluctantly trade my Austin Healey 100 for. It's the Ace the Ace Rudd Speed Roadster. The Ace is one of the most coveted 1950s British sports cars, and this example is particularly special. Originally distributed through Rudds of Worthing and with a continuous known history for most of its life. In 1962, it was fitted with not only the Ford 2.6 litre engine by BRM garages of Bourne to Rudd Speed spec, but also with the Raymond Mays conversion, making it even more competitive in contemporary club racing. More recently, the car was acquired in 2012 by the current owner and a complete and extensive restoration, uh, nut and bolt restoration ensued, uh, entrusting um, the Ace to Spray Tech, well, quite possibly the best automotive paint shop in the UK. The car is resplendent, rather appropriately, in BRM green with green leather trim. Uh, there's an alternative taller driver's package of trim that comes with the car, for those of you who are sort of up and around six foot three, six foot four. And uh, the original engine block too, uh, from uh, when it had its previous engine, with some 120,000 pounds spent on the restoration, uh, this Ace is superbly presented, visually stunning, and with performance to match. Well, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. It's just down here to my right, beautifully presented Ace. And again, we're here to sell it. Let's open the bidding at 100,000 pounds. 100,000 for the ace. 100,000. We're opening at 100. Any advance at 100,000 pounds bid. At 100,000. 100. 10, 110,000. Thank you, Jonathan. At 110,000 bid. 110,000. Any advance at 110. 110. Is bid. 110,000. 120,000. 120. It's against you, Jonathan. 120,000. 
120,000. 130,000. Thank you. See if this wins it for you. 130,000. Any advance at 130,000. 130, I'm bid at 130,000. Well, it's your bid. I cannot believe it, ladies and gentlemen. 130,000. 140,000 back in. 140,000. Another one if you like, Jonathan. Otherwise, you're going to miss it. 140,000. Any more bids now? 140,000. Going at 140 now. Well, it's really, really good value at that, ladies and gentlemen. 140,000. Take another bid. 140,000. Five, Jonathan. 145. Keep it in fives. Keep it in fives. 150,000. Another five if you like, but I'm at 150,000. Well, you will miss it. You will miss it. Take another five. I'm at 150,000. Any more bids? At 150,000, I have. Going at 150. 155. 155. 155. Any more bids? Well, it's against you both now. 155 for the ace. All done at 155. 155 it is. Thank you. Lot number 337. Well, I told you we had a broad church of entries today, ladies and gentlemen. How about this? The Cooper Bobtail, piloted by the likes of Jack Brabham and Sterling Moss in period. The iconic mid-engine 1950s sports racer proved popular with some of motor racing's most famous names mentioned in Doug Nye's Cooper Cars book. The bobtail offered today is sold with fresh FIA papers and presents an opportunity to race at iconic circuits such as Spa, Silverstone, and of course here at Goodwood. Well, can you imagine that? Herring round Goodwood, ladies and gentlemen. Telephones coming through. Please note the FIA historic technical passport is currently being processed. That will follow post sale. That's just getting rubber stamped, sent over for you, offered with that HTP to be coming. And again, we've got. £60,000, get it going, £60,000, Cooper Bobtail, 60, 60, 65, 65, your bid, sir, your car, your Bobtail, 65, 70, 70, at 75, 75, 75, well, thank you anyway, your bid, 75,000, any advance on 75, 80, new bidder, I'll have to come back to you, sir, 80,000, I've got three of you on it, 80,000. Who's next? First past the post, 80,000. 85,000, you're back in. 85,000. 85,000, 90,000. Be with you in a moment, 90,000. 90. Telephones are waiting. Telephone, 95,000. 95,000. 95,000. In the center against you both, 95,000. 100,000. 100,000. You will miss it. The telephones are waiting. 100,000. Your bid against you center now. 100,000. Any more bids now? 105,000. Telephones are in against you. All three of you. Telephones are in. 105. Where well, you can see the bid. There it is. 105,000. Any more bids at 105,000 pounds. We shall sell at 105. Fair warning, there's no further bids. Are you sure, gents? 105,000, thank you. That's your bidder, Gregor. Thank you, 5111. And we move on to lot number 338. 338. Well, it's uh, the Range Rover from Cooper Bobtail to the Range Rover, the early Range Rovers are very much a collector's car nowadays. Here it is, and this particular example is historic in that it is the last two-door example built, benefiting from uh, recent restoration as well. As I say, they're very much a bit of a cult car now, these early two-door Range Rovers. And again, where should we start it? Where should we start it? 28,000, let's get going, 28,000. Any advance on 28,000? 28,000, 30,000, your bid, your Range Rover at 30,000, any advance on 30, 30,000, 32,000, here at 32, 32, 35, 
35,000. Here's bid. Your bid against your seated. 35,000. Any more bids now? At 35,000. Going at 35. Are we done? Any more bids at 35,000? 38. 40, sir? 40,000. 40,000. I've taken 40 here. You at 38. 40,000. Is bid at 40,000. 40,000. Going at 40. Any more bids at 40? Are we done? 40,000. Well, sell the car at 40,000. If there's no further bids, it's against you. Take 42. Otherwise, I'm selling it at 40. 42, sir. Well, thank you anyway. Thank you, sir. 40,000 the bids here. Are we done? At 40. 40,000. At 40,000. Congratulations. At 40,000. 529, is it? 529. Thank you. At 40,000. And we move on to lot number. Lot number. Yes. Dear, oh dear. Peter Mullin hasn't built the museum yet. You're going to load it up soon, aren't you? At, uh, at 339, it's the V12 E Type Roadster. Well, this one has a great specification manual transmission, chrome wire wheels, and hard top. Doesn't get better than that, does it? There you go. USA left hand drive car in highly original condition with just three owners from new. So, ladies and gentlemen, there it is. And again, we've already got 45,000 off for it. 45,000. 45,000. The V12 E type at 45,000. Manual chrome wire wheels with that hard top. 45, 48,000. Thank you, bid. At 48,000. 48. Your bid at 48 and going. Going at 48. 50. 50, I've got. 50, I've got. 50. Going at 50. Any more now? 50. 52. 52. 55. 55, I have. At 55. Next is 58, but at 55,000. 55, I've got. Any advance on 55? 55, going at 55, are we done? Fair warning, 55,000. Take another bid if you like, but I'm at 55,000. 55, not enough, let's move on. And on to lot number 340. Lot 340. Well, look at that, ladies and gentlemen. I do think... Marcello Gandini, the designer at Bertoni, played an absolute blinder with the Carmsen. One of the best looking cars of that angular art era. Great example here, an original rare right hand drive example. Got the five speed manual transmission and restored by Maserati's finest, McGrath Maserati, here in the UK. Well, what do you think, ladies and gentlemen? They really are stunning, stunning design. And where do, we, where do we start it? 70,000 for it? 70,000 for the Carmson at 70,000. Here to sell it. 70,000 I have. 70,000. 75,000. Thank you. Straight in. Saving me time. 75,000. 75, 80. 80,000. 85,000. 85,000. Well, you will miss it, sir. Your bid, 85,000. Going at 85. Any advance? 85,000. Any more bids at 85,000? 90 are back. 90 is back at 90. 90. 92, 92, you've got him on the rails, sir. You've got him on the ropes. 92,000, 95 if you wish. 95 if you wish, I've got 92. 95, 95, 98 if it's too psychological for you, sir. 95, 95, 95, well thank you anyway, 95 I'm bid. Take another three, make it 98 if you like, or 100 if you want the glory bid. But I've got 95 bid. Any advance now? Any advance for the Carmson. One of the prettiest cars out there. 95,000 going at 95. 95 it is. Well done indeed. And uh, commiserations. Lot number 341. Lot 341. Well, over to the Jaguar now. There it is. To me, the Series 1 Roadster is one of the nicest cars to own. Sublime looks, sheer joy to drive as well. And this example is in stunning condition, having been thoroughly, completely, recently restored. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. Stunning Series 1 4.2 Roadster. And again, already I've got 80,000 offer for it. 80,000. 
80,000. Your bid, sir, at 80,000. Going at 80. 80,000. Here at 80. Any more bids at 80. I can't believe it. 80,000. 90. 90. 90,000. Your bid on the left at 90. Well, it's against you seated. 90,000 I've got. 100,000. 100,000. 100,000. Going at 100. Going at 100. Any more bids at 100,000. 100 I have at 100. And five. Take five. 105. Take 10, sir. I've got 105. Take 10 if you wish. 105. Here at 105. 110. 110 I'm bid at 110,000. Going at 110,000. 115,000. 115,000. It's still against you, sir. 115,000. On my left. Against you on my right. 115,000. Series 1 Roadster. Immaculately restored at 115,000. Take another five. Otherwise, we'll cut her loose at 115,000. Last time of asking then, 115. 115,000 it is. Thank you. Got you. Lot number three. Thank you. Three, four, two. Well, we sold the Cooper Bobtail earlier. Now, the big brother, the Cooper Monaco, the Jackie Stewart, Jack Brabham, Roy Salvadori, Tommy Dixon, Bruce Halford, Cooper Monaco prototype. A period participant for a Curia Cos at Le Mans, 24 hours and used by the team extensively in period at the most prestigious venues and motor racing circuits on both sides of the pond. No fewer than 17 first place finishes with the Curia Cos. It's well known to us form part of the great Dick Skipworth collection that Bonham sold a few years ago and has since been extensively restored to highly competitive order. Uh, please note the registration number DS288. Not currently with the vehicle, but an application should get that back for you. So, ladies and gentlemen, again, we can open the bidding at £200,000. £200,000. At £200,000. 200,000. Opening bid at 200,000. Any advance on 210? Yes, 210 I have at 210,000. 210. Nearer me in about the fifth row, 210,000. 220, 220 bid. 220. 230,000. 40,000. 240,000. 50,000. 250,000. 250 now, 250, 260, 260, 260, 260, no more, well thank you anyway, your bid 260,000, any advance, your bid 260, any more bids at 260,000, going at 260, still against you seated, 260 standing, are we done at 260, 270, 270,000 bid at 270. Still against you then, 270,000 and going. Are we done? Are we done? Any more? 270,000. Fair warning. All done then. 270,000. Thank you. Lot number 343. Lot 343. Well, another magnificent car for you today, ladies and gentlemen. It's the, uh, the Bentley 6.5 litre, the Gurney Nutting Saloon. Just showing a little bit up on my right. Quite remarkably, been in the current ownership for over 53 years. Standard 6 saloons are incredibly rare, with only six known survivors and one of only two with Gurney Nutting coachwork. Originally ordered by the Bird family of Bird's Custard fame, the Bentley has only had three owners from new. Three owners from new. It's a 1928 car, ladies and gentlemen. And recent Dr. Claire Hay report was incredibly complimentary and confirms that it's a matching numbers example offered in the centenary year of Bentley Motors. We are delighted to offer this magnificent six and a half. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. There it is. And where should we start it? Where should we start it? 450,000 pounds for it? 450,000 pounds. 
The Bentley's six and a half litre. 53 years in current ownership. 450,000. 480,000, thank you, bid. Your bid, 480,000. We're off and running at 480,000. Any advance on 480,000? 500,000. Your bid, 500,000. 520,000. 520,000 is bid. Your bid at 520,000. It's against you. 550,000. 550,000 I bid. Well, at 550, it's on my left. It's against you on my right. 550,000. Any advance? 550,000 I have at 550. Any advance at 550? 580? 580, new bidder, 580,000. Three of you on it, 580,000. Your bid against you on my left and against you on my right. It's further left at 580,000. Against you both, 580,000 I'm bid. Any advance at 580,000. Are we done? 580,000. Well, if there's no further bids, we will have to call it then at 580,000. If there's no further bids, are we sure? 580,000, that's a pass. We'll move on, ladies and gentlemen, to lot number 344. Well, ladies and gentlemen, it's the Dexter Brown painting before we offer one of the undoubted stars of today's cell. It's the Dexter Brown painting of the Williams FW 14B. Uh, and, uh, ladies and gentlemen, we're here to sell it, ladies and gentlemen. An original Dexter Brown commissioned especially for the sale of the car. Proceeds going to charity. And what should we say? £3,000, get it going at 3000 £3,000, an original Dexter Brown. It's worth more than that, ladies and gentlemen. £3,000 anywhere? Well, £2,000, £2,000 for it. Any of us at two? Two thousand. Two thousand. Two thousand five online. Online is bidding. Two thousand five. I have to sell it, ladies and gentlemen. It's no reserve. It's a bargain to me at two thousand five hundred pounds. Proceeds to charity for the Dexter Brown. Take another bid. Otherwise, we'll sell it to the maiden bid then at two thousand five hundred pounds. Fair warning and going at two thousand five hundred pounds. 5061, congratulations online, 2,500, 5061, ladies and gentlemen, lot 345, red five. <laughs> privilege to present absolutely one of the most iconic Formula One cars of modern times. This is the 1992 Williams Renault FW14B as driven by British world champion Nigel Mansell to win five of his record-breaking total of ten Grand Prix in that one extraordinary season. Five of those Grand Prix wins fell to Nigel in this very car as marked by the winner's stars that decorate its cockpit today. 27 years after the proud Williams mechanics originally applied them. And they are accompanied by five more stars for this car's pole positions. Today, Adrian Newey is one of racing history's most celebrated Formula One designers. These Williams FW14Bs were the very first of his many world championship title winners. As you've just seen, 
Williams Renault chassis 8, as offered here, is completely operational. Renault V12 engine, six-speed gearbox, and Frontier Technology Active Suspension all working well. And guess what? There's still more. The Renault engine in the car, number 240, is the actual engine that won not only the South African Grand Prix, but that year's German Grand Prix too. Ladies and gentlemen, we offer you Nigel Mansell's Williams, the legendary Red 5. Well, as you'd expect, interest will come through, and I can open the bidding at 1,000,000. £700,000. £1,700,000 is the opening bid. £1,700,000. Any advance at £1,700,000. Any more bids at £1,700,000. £1,800,000. £1,800,000. Thank you. At £1,800,000 I have. Going at £1,800,000. £1,900,000. Your bid on my right against you on the left. £1,900,000. Any more at £1,900,000. Two million pounds bid. Two million pounds I have at two million pounds. At two million pounds. It's against on my left, it's your bid on the right. Two million pounds. Any advance on two million pounds? Two million one hundred thousand. Two million one hundred thousand. On the telephone. Against you both. Two million one hundred thousand. Two million one hundred thousand. At 2,200,000. 2,200,000. Again, well, it's with you, sir. It's against you, Malcolm, and it's against you, sir. 2,300,000. Two 2,300,000. Two it's on the telephone. It's against you, sir. And it's against you, sir, too, but 2,300,000. Any more bids at 2,300,000? Any more bids? Well, Malcolm has it on the telephone, 2,300,000. Any more bids now? 2,300,000. Fair warning. At two million three, take fifty if you like, sir. And to you as well, sir. But the bids here at two million three hundred thousand, take fifty if you like. At two million three hundred thousand, two million three hundred and fifty thousand. 2,350,000. Now it's against your bidder, Malcolm. On my left, at 2,350,000. Same for you, Malcolm, if you wish. Another 50 if you wish. 2,400,000. Malcolm, you missed the bid. Still taking 50s. And for you as well, sir. 2,400,000. At two million four hundred thousand in the room. At two million four hundred thousand, the bids in the room. It's against you, sir. Against you, sir. At two, they're out. Thank them anyway. Two million four hundred thousand. Going to a great home. Two million four hundred thousand. We're here. We're selling Red Five here at Bonhams at the Festival of Speed. Congratulations, sir. Two million four hundred thousand. Well done. Sorry, I didn't, didn't didn't quite get that. Five two four. Thank you. Five two four. Uh, thank their bidding anyway, Malcolm. Lot number three four six. Lot three four six. Well, sticking to the competition theme, ladies and gentlemen. Sticking to the competition theme, here's the 1933 RAC TT MG J4. It's probably the smallest car we've got in the tent. Arguably the ultimate pre-war racing MG, regarded as the baby K3, the J4 punched above its weight in international races and rallies throughout Europe. None more so than this car in the hands of the legendary Hugh Hamilton, 
who used it to frighten Grand Prix cars and the legendary Tazio Nuvolari. As illustrious, as illustrious uh, former owner David Piper put it, a lovely car. Well, ladies and gentlemen, again, interest coming through, and I've already got £120,000 for it. 120000 120000 130000 Thank you, bid. 130000 130, 140, 140 I have now, 140,000, the J4, 140, 150, 150, your bid at 150, I've taken 150 in the pink shirt, 150,000, 150 now, 150's bid, 160 now, 160, 160,000, 160,000, any advance at 160,000, Going at 160, 170, 170, 180, yours at 170. Any advance, 170,000, 180,000, 180,000. Third row bidder, selling all the way at one, one, 190,000, 190 I bid, 200,000. Two hundred thousand. You can put it in your pocket and take it away, sir. Two hundred thousand. Do you want ten? Five. Two hundred five thousand. You've got him on the rope, sir. Two hundred five. Two ten next. Two ten. Two ten. Fifteen. If in doubt, bid. That's my motto, sir. It's, it's a long, lonely walk back to the car. 215,000. 215,000. What do you think, sir? 215. It's the only J4 I've got today. Two seventeen and a half. Two seventeen and a half. You're oh so close, sir. 217 and a half, 220. No. 217 and a half, the bid is here. Spirited bidding. Just think of the walk back to the car, sir. It could have been yours for another two and a half thousand. We don't know unless we try. What do we think, sir? 220,000. 222 and a half. No. <laughs> no. 220. He's walking away. Never a good sign. 222 and a half. It's in the third row. 222 and a half. CP, another two and a half. Another two and a half. Don't hide from me behind Shane. 222,500 here. Selling the car. Last chance. Thanks anyway. 222 and a half. Congratulations. Uh, spirited bidding. 501. Well done. 222,500. <laughs> uh, sorry, Charlie. On to lot number 347. Lot 347. Well, it's the DB4 Series 4. And... Uh, one of the most collectible post-war Astons being one of only 31 right-hand drive uh, DB4 Vantages. Uh, those of you standing, we've got plenty of seats uh, uh, available if you'd like to uh, rest your legs. Uh, the DB4, 31 right-hand drive DB4 Vantages built and one of seven fitted with the DB4 GT dashboard or instrument panel. Great history file with all its previous owners listed in the late 90s, regular at the AMOC Concours attendee. Uh, with its then active club member, just been freshly serviced by Aston Martin Works, now ready for the summer ahead. Two telephones coming through, two telephones coming through. Interest I have already, £300,000 gets it going. £300,000, £300,000, 320000 bid, 320000 350000 350, 350 I've got. There's lots of interest, 380000 380000 380, 400, 400, your bid, 400,000. It's been one of the most well-viewed cars in the sale, 400,000, 
any advance at 400,000, your bid against you on the right, against you on the left, against you on the phones, 400,000. Looks like it's yours at 400,000. Any more bids? 500? Sorry? 5,000, five I thought you went 500,000. 405,000. I can have a laugh with you, Neil. 405,000. It's your, your, your bid at 405. Any advance at 405,000. Any more bids? Selling the car if there's no better bid. Selling the car if there's no better bid at 405,000. Are we done? Well, are we done then? 405,000. Neil, that's to you. 405, congratulations. 238, well played, 238. And we move on to lot number 348 now. It's the, uh, the Corniche 5 convertible. Well, there's Luxury, and then there's the Corniche 5 that took it to an altogether different level. Just the £250,000 spent when new, and uh, only 27,000 miles or so since new as well. So it really was a luxury, very, very expensive car in its day. Looks good value today. Interest already at 60, 65, 70,000, I can say. 70,000, 70,000, 75,000 bid at 75,000. Going at 75, going at 75. I can't believe it. 80, 5, 85. Straight back at you, sir. 85,000, 85,000. Any more bids at 85,000? Are we done? 85,000, 85, 90. 90,000 I'm bid at 90,000. Going at 90. Any more bids at 90,000? Are we done? 90,000 for the Corniche 5. Fair warning and going at 90,000. 90,000. Not quite there on that one. Let's move on to 349. Lot 349. Well, as I said earlier, we do have a tremendous selection of cars for you today, ladies and gentlemen. Another one of the highlights, this very rare Squire, one of only seven built and was first owned by Val Zethrin, who competed with the car on the 1936 RAC Rally. Formerly owned by collector Henry Petronis in the 1980s, the Squire was purchased by the current owner uh, at Retromobile in 2011, uh, who then commissioned CMC to undertake a full restoration to this incredible standard uh, you see before you. Over 4,100 hours was put into the car, ladies and gentlemen. It was then invited to the Royal Concours at uh, Hollywood House and Villa d'Este. Each of the remaining squires are held by museums and significant collections. Um, really quite unlikely that another squire is going to come to market anytime soon. Again, here to sell it, 400,000. I can open the bidding app. 400,000. Thank you, bid. At 400,000. 400,000. Any advance at 400. 420. 420. Good to see you. 420,000. Your bid at 420,000. Going at 420. 450. 450,000. 480,000. It's the Squire. Magnificent car. 480,000. 500,000. 500. I'm bid at 500. 500, take 20, keep it small if it helps you, sir. 520,000, it does. Same to you, sir, 520,000. On my left, your bid, 520,000. Any advance? At 520,000, I have. Going at 520,000. 530,000. Keep it in tens, 530,000. 540,000. 540,000. It's still with you, still against you, sir. 540,000. Take another bid. 540,000. 550. 560. 560. Are you sure? 560,000. You've been with me nearly all the way. 
560,000. Well, you will miss it, sir. 560,000 is bid. Here it is. Here's the bid. 560,000. Take another 10. Take another 10. Otherwise, we'll let it go at 560,000. Are we sure? Are you sure as well, sir? 560 then and going. 560,000 it is. Thank you. Lot number 350. Thank you, Neil. Lot uh, 350,000. Well, it's the Abbott Bentley, ladies and gentlemen. There it is. The Abbott bodied Bentley is the closest you'll get to a mull and a fastback for a fraction of the price. One of just 16 built with known history. And again, a lot of car for the money, I reckon. And again, 70,000. Starts us off at 70,000. 70,000 I have at 70,000. Any advance on 70? 70,000. 70,000. Thank you at 70. 75,000. 75,000. Going at 75. Going at 75. 80,000. 80,000. 85,000. 85,000. For the Abbott. Well, it does look good value at that, doesn't it? It does look good value at 85,000. Take another five. Take another five at 85,000. All done. 85,000. That's a pass. We'll move on. Let's move on to lot number 351. Well, there it is, ladies and gentlemen. A little bit of Miami Vice comes to Chichester. Low mileage Testarossa. Just 26,500 or so miles from you. Rare UK delivered right-hand drive example. For a flagship Ferrari of its day, they do represent good value, don't they? There it is, the Testarossa. And again, let's get it sold. 50,000, we can open the bidding at 50,000 for the Testarossa. At 50,000, 50,000. Any advance on 50? 55,000. Good to see you, Michael. 55,000. Here at 55, 60. 65,000. 70. 75 if you like. 70 I've got bid at 70,000. Going at 70. Any advance on 70? 70,000 I'm bid at 70,000. 75,000. Still against you, sir. 75,000. Still against you. 80,000. 80,000. 80,000 I have at 80,000. 80,000 bid at 80,000. Are you sure? Well, thank you anyway. 80,000 we have. Going at 80. Any more? 80,000. 80,000. Thank you. Uh, same as the last. Lot number 352. 352. Well, sticking to the V12 Ferrari theme. Scroll forward a few years from the Testaros. Soon you get the 550 Marinello. Right hand drive, low miles, and extensive service history. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. Really, really nice car. Got quite a nice uh, number plate coming with it, too. And, uh, well, already I can open the bidding at uh, 40, 45,000. 45,000, I'm bid. 45,000. 45,000. 45,000. Any advance on 45,000? Well, it's a bargain at that, isn't it? 45,000. Any more bids? 45,000. Are we done? 45,000. 50,000. 50,000, 50,000, 55,000, 55,000. In the room against your bid, Ben. 55 with you, sir. 55. Fifty-seven, five. Fifty-seven, five. Sixty thousand. Bids there, seven rows back, 62.5. No more. 62.5 is bid, 62.5. Here at 62.5, it's on the telephone. 62.5, telephone has it. 65,000. Bits in the room, against the phone, 65,000. Any advance? 
Any advance? 65,000 in the room against your bidder, Ben. 67.5? 66? 66. You've got him on the rope, sir. I can feel it. It just needs a little uppercut, a little jab, and it might just do it. 66. 67. 67. Sixty-eight. <laughs> Seventy. Tactical bidding. Seventy thousand. Tactical bidding. What do you want to say, Ben? Eighty is quite a good number. Seventy-two also works. Seventy-two five. Seventy-three. Seventy-three. No, I thought you might have him on the ropes then. Seventy-three thousand. Slugging it out. Seventy-three thousand. Ben is the last one today in the sale at seventy-three thousand. Seventy-five. Seventy-three five hundred. Seventy-three five hundred. Serves you right, Star. You sorted it. At seventy-three five. Seventy-five, seventy-five. It's all over the place. Seventy-five thousand. Trying to shake them off. Trying to shake each other off. Definite no. Definite no. Seventy-five thousand. <laughs> Looks like you've got it, sir. Seventy-five thousand. Oh, we all done. Three sixty. Well played, sir. Seventy-five. Three sixty. It is seventy-five thousand. Well done indeed. And uh, thank you so much. Lot number three five three. Lot 353, three. well, it's the, uh, the little mini, the wooden picket. Converted minis were sought after by showbiz celebrities in the swinging 60s. And this example has a host of celebrity owners, including David Weir, a man I knew quite well, actually. Racer and Le Mans participant, lovely, laconic New Yorker. Celebrity hairdresser, Leonard Lewis. John Hamill, who was Paul McCartney's personal assistant. And Denny Lane of Moody Blues and Wings fame. It's the only Mini Cooper S Mark II converted to Margrave spec by Wooden Picket. So it has that uniqueness coming with it as well as the great provenance. And uh, again, where should we start it? Who wants to uh, remember the swinging 60s? 30,000 for it? 30,000? 30,000? 30,000 bid. Thank you. At 30,000 we have. At 30,000. 30,000. 32, Owen, 32,000 bid. Thank you, at 32,000. Well, it's your bid, Owen, at 32,000. 35,000. 35. 35. 38,000. 38,000. At 38,000. Any more bids at 38,000. The Mini Margrave at 38,000. It's a Cooper S Margrave at 38,000. Any more bids? Take another one, take another two, I don't mind, but I'm at 38,000. Any more bids at 38,000? We're here, we're going, are we done then at 38,000? Not quite there on that one. Unlucky Owen, we'll see if we can find you another one later. Lot number 354, lot 354. Well, a significant car for you today, ladies and gentlemen. The Lola T70, a T70 with absolutely all of the credentials, known history from new, period race history in the USA, a winner in historic racing, beautifully prepared and on the button, comes with a spares package and also comes with both that coupe as it is today and the spider body clips with it as well. So you can do classic Le Mans in the coupe form Put the spider on, take it to Laguna Seca for the Monterey Historics. What a season you would have, ladies and gentlemen. It's the Lola T70. It's a really significant car. Delighted to offer it. Very, very sensibly priced and well worth the money. I already have £240,000 offered for the car. 240000 for the T70. T70, eligible absolutely everywhere and a winner. 
260,000. 260,000, your bid at 260,000. Any advance on 260? 260, 280. New bidder, 280,000 seated. 280,000 seated. 280,000, 300,000. 300,000 standing against you seated. At 300,000, it's your bid, sir. 300,000, the Lola T70 at 300,000. At 300,000. Take 10 if you wish, seated, but I'm at 300,000. Take 10 if you wish. The bid's here, standing. Take 10. Take 10 if you like, 310,000. Same for you, sir, but the bid's at 310. Nearer me now, against you standing, 310,000. Take another 10. The Lola T70 at 310,000. Any more bids? 310,000. Not quite. Do have a word with us afterwards. 310,000. See if we can get that sold for you. Lot number 355. Onto the Lee Francis. Well, we really are offering you a broad church of consignments today. How about a Corsica bodied Lee Francis? There it is. One of just three built, ladies and gentlemen. Three built. Beautifully restored, as you can see. And again, already I've got 50, 55, 60,000 already offered here. 60, 65,000. Thank you. 65,000. 65,000 pounds. Going at 65,000. Well, the bid's at 65. The Lee Francis, the Corsica bodied, one of three cars. Corsica bodied, then at 65,000. Any advance at 65, 68,000. Your bid, 68, I've got. Next is 70. 68 I have. Next is 70. Any more bids now? 68,000. Any more bids? Are we done? 68? No more? Well, we'll pass that lot, ladies and gentlemen. We'll pass that lot. Let's move on to lot number 356. Well, ladies and gentlemen, it really is an absolute plethora of variety for you in today's sale. This is the famous Metallurgique. Very proud to offer here today for the first time in 30 years one of the most iconic, pure enthusiast cars ever to have featured within the British Register. It's one of the longest lived Zeppelin airship engine specials preserved for over a century. A defining VSEC motor car, it even featured on the opening racing scenes of the classic 1968 movie Chitty Chitty Bang Bang. It's still a current class speed record holder, no less. Recently described as one of the world's greatest cars. Ladies and gentlemen, it is the Metallurgique, the Zeppelin airship engine Metallurgique. Where should we start it, ladies and gentlemen? Where should we start it? 400,000 pounds for it? 400,000? 400,000 for the Metallurgique. 400,000. 400,000 bid. Thank you. Your bid at 400,000. Going at four. 400 I have. Any advance on four? 420,000. Buy the car. 420,000. 450,000. Is it an omen? 450,000. 480,000. 480,000. 500,000. And 20. 520. 520. 520. 550. A little bit of thinking time, but not for you. 580. Still by the car, 580,000, 580,000. It's against you seated. Further back, 580,000. The Metallurgique. First time coming to market for 30 years. Any advance at 580,000. It's your bid at 580,000. Any more bids? 580,000. Any more bids now? 580, 600. 600, new bidder. 600 I have at 600. 620. 620. Well, it's against you seated, against you on the right. Further back at 620,000. Any advance now? 
Another one if you like, sir, but I've got 620,000. Another one if you like. Well, thank you anyway. 620,000. Any more bids? Good to see you at 620,000. Any more bids now? Are we done? We are. Thank you, 620,000. And moving on, thank you very much. Lot number 357. Well, it's the, uh, the 365 GTC4. I'm a big fan of these 365 GTC4s. One of the nicest V12 Ferraris to drive. And this is an example, is a cracker. Fully restored by Joe Macari. Stunning condition and offered with the Ferrari Classifica certification. So, ladies and gentlemen, it has all the credentials. Good ownership, comes from a good stable too. And again, already we can open the bidding here at uh, £200,000 for it. 200000 for the 365 GTC4. 200, I've got. 200, 210, 210, thank you. 210, thank you at 210. 210, online you are fluttering, but I've got 210 in the room. It's against you online and any more bids at 210, 220, 220, 220, 230. You're in online. Online has it at 230,000. 230,000. The bids here, it's against you both. 230, 240, 240,000. Against you online now. The bids in the room at 240,000. Going at 240 now. The 365 GTC4. There it is at 240,000. Any more bids now? Any more bids? Well, you will miss it online. The bids here at 240,000. It's here and it's going at 240,000. All done. 240,000. Thank you. Very close. Let's move on to 358, ladies and gentlemen. Well, another one of the stars of today's sale. What a history. Old Mother Gun, the first ever Bentley four and a half litre off the line. Bentley team car, Le Mans winner, nicknamed Old Mother Gun by none other than Captain Wolf Bonato. Subsequently owned and modified by Richard Marker in the 1930s for Brooklyn circuit racing, going on to achieve the coveted 120 and 130 mile an hour Brooklyn's badges. Marker then commissioned Jacksons of Brooklyn's, the uh, respected tuners and builders to build a streamlined single seat body and also extended the chassis to increase high speed stability. In the early 1960s, Vaughan Davis acquired the car and rebuilt it together with Stanley Mann, the much loved Stanley Mann, with the intention to break the British Class B 500 mile record, the unlimited three hour record and the 200 mile record all on one day at Millbrook and it was all comfortably achieved with His Royal Highness Prince Michael of Kent included in the team of drivers in 1990. Since acquiring Mother Gun some years ago, the owners have also campaigned the car and shown it here at Goodwood, the Revival, and indeed the Festival of Speed, where it was one of the 25 invited cars for the Silver Jubilee. As you'd expect, it comes with an extensive history file that befits probably one of the most important Bentley specials to come to the market. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I already have £800,000 as the opening offer at £800,000. Any advance on £800,000? The bid is here at eight hundred. pounds Any more bids? At £800,000. £850,000. Thank you, bid. At £850,000. Towards the back, seated at 850,000. In advance at 850,000. 900,000. No, yes, 950,000. One million bid. One million of my bid. One million. One million. Well, thank you anyway. You got me going. Your bid at one million. In advance now, one million pounds I have at one million pounds. Thank you very much. You got me going. 1,100,000. New bidder. New bidder. 1,100,000. Further back. 1,100,000. Against you, seat and against you, sir. Your bid. Any advance. 1,200,000. 1, 1, 1, 1,200,000. 1,200,000.
1,200,000 and sorry, 1,250,000. I've got, I'll get there, sir. 1,250,000. 1,300,000. Keep it in 50s. Keep it in 50s. 1,300,000. One million three hundred fifty thousand. One million three hundred fifty thousand. On my left, it's against you. One million three hundred fifty thousand. One million four hundred thousand. Old mother gun. One million four hundred thousand. A significant Bentley in the centenary year, one million four hundred thousand. Well, at one million four hundred thousand, no more. Try another if you wish, but I'm at one million four hundred thousand. Seated. Thank you anyway. One million four hundred thousand. It's against you both. Take another 50, but I'm at 1,400,000. I'll take another 50. Fair warning, here at Goodwood, the Bonhams Festival of Speed sale, Old Mother Gun, at 1,400,000. Fair warning, gentlemen, at 1,400,000 and going, you sure? Well, thank you anyway, 1,400,000. That's yours. Thank you. 1,400,000. Thank you indeed. Moving on to lot number 359. Lot 359. Well, ladies and gentlemen, it's a car we know very well. It's the XK120 that we've had a couple of times before, especially the discs and spats. They are, to me, one of the prettiest cars of the early post-war period. Beautiful and stylish cars. Desirable early car, you can tell that by the separate chrome side lights on top of the wings, which is a, a nice touch. And little wonder that the first owner was a famous actor. Well, it's the 120, ladies and gentlemen. And again, I can already open the bidding at uh, 85,000 pounds, at 85,000. 85,000, any of us on 85,000, 85,000, 90,000, 90 bid, 90,000, yours at 90. Any advance, 90 I'm bid, at 90, 90, five, 95,000, 95,000, 100,000, 100,000. Keep it in five, so don't mind. Keep it in fives, 105. 10 is next, 10 is next, 105 I've got. One, yes, 110, 110, going at 110, going at 110, 15 if you like, but 110 is bid. 110 is bid, 15 if you like. Well, at 110,000, any more bids at 110? Fair warning, going at 110. 110,000, that's not enough, we'll pass the lot. Let's move on to lot number 360. Now, this one has caught my eye, lot 360. My appreciation really for the Ghibli has grown in recent years, so easy to default one's eye to a Daytona, but when you look at that uh, Gijaro did for gear, he penned a masterclass of automotive design. Everything is perfect from the chrome grill to the rear quarter lights into the perfect slope of the rear. Each time you look, you see perfect form. Here's the ultimate spec Ghibli. It's the 49 SS, one of only 12 right-hand drive models in the UK, or supplied in the UK. I dare say there's less today. So it's a 4.9 SS, it's right-hand drive, one of 12, and really up against the Daytona, it does look an absolute bargain, doesn't it? So without further ado, we can open the bidding at 160,000 pounds, 160,000 for the Ghibli 4.9 SS, 160,000. Any advance on 160? I have 160. Any more bids? 160. 170 online. You have it online, 170,000. Online bidder, 170,000, 180,000. Great to see you, Robert, 180,000. Bids in the room, 180,000, 180,000. Against you online, 
One, 190,000. You're back in. Online at 190. 195. 195. Next will be 200, Navy. Next will be 200,000. 195 bid. 195,000. Against you online. Next is two. The bid's in the room. Next is 200. 195,000. Don't miss it for 5,000. 195, two. Yes, 200,000 is bid. Thank you. 200,000. Back online at 200,000. Against you in the room. 205,000. 205. Back in the room against you online. 205,000. At 205,000. Well, you will miss a magnificent car. The more I look at the Ghiblis, the more I appreciate them. The bid is in the room at 205,000. We're selling the car. It's a 207.5. Yes, 207.5. 210. 2.10. Two hundred and ten. Look good next to that Marinello, sir. Two hundred and ten. Two twelve five. Keeping it small, keeping it fair. Two twelve five. It's a four nine SS. Beautiful colour. Two hundred and fifteen thousand. Look very nice next to that Marinello, sir. 215, have you got that? Two, yep, that's great, sorry, it's come through. 215. They only built 12. 217.5, oh, Robert. Robert, I was beginning to have some fun with you. Two, no, don't get, don't get like that with me. 217.5, no, no. That charity auction I did for you in Farnham counts for nothing, does it? <laughs> 217,500. 220. There you go. There's no such thing as a free charity auction here. 200. No, come on, sir. Oh, sir. 220,000. No, 222.5. One of 12. Got to be less than 222.5. Keep it fair. Yep, 222.5. I'll do another charity auction for you, Robert. No? Well, you've been a sport. You've been a sport. 222.5. It looks like it's going to sit next to the Marinello. 222.5. All done. You got it. Congratulations, sir. 222.500. 360. Well done indeed. It's a great car. I really, really do like them nowadays. Lot number 361. 361. Well, they don't form part of the Musée de l'Automobile Mougin collection for a number of years. Upon museum dispersal, the 300SL was acquired by a Dr. Pfeiffer, who commissioned a last nut and bolt restoration, which included the desired uprating to front disc brakes. Dr. Pfeiffer, having covered just 1,000 miles, sold it through Bonhams at the Goodwood Revival auction back in 2007, where it was acquired by the current owner, a notable connoisseur collector. Well, ladies and gentlemen, the Mercedes-Benz 300 SL, there they are. <laughs> Telephones coming through. Iconic they are. And uh, where should we start it? We're here to sell it, ladies and gentlemen, here to sell it. We can open the bidding at 500 thousand pounds at five hundred thousand pounds we can open the bidding app for the 300 sl roast and it's worth a lot more than that ladies and gentlemen five hundred thousand pounds at five hundred five hundred twenty thousand thank you bid five hundred twenty thousand your bid at five hundred twenty thousand at five twenty five fifty thousand five hundred fifty thousand nine bid at five hundred fifty thousand five hundred eighty thousand came in just before you sir five hundred eighty thousand five hundred eighty thousand 600,000, 600,000 bid at 600,000, 
six, six, twenty thousand. Six hundred and twenty thousand. Six hundred and twenty thousand. It's on the telephone at six twenty. On the telephone at six hundred and twenty thousand. Any advance at six hundred and twenty thousand. Any more bids at six hundred and twenty thousand bid. It's against you, sir. The telephone has it at six hundred and twenty thousand. Well, at 620,000, it's your bit of Tim going at 620,000. Any more bids at 620,000? Take another one if you wish. But here's the bid 620,000 bid. Any more bids with you, Tim? 620,000. Any more bids at 630,000? 630,000. 660,000. Six hundred sixty thousand. Spirited bidding from the telephone. But you can bid another 10 if you wish. I don't mind. 660,000. Take another 10. I don't mind. The bid's here at 660. Take another 10 at 660. Any more bids? At 6, 670. 6, 670. You're making yourself popular down here, sir. 670,000. At 670,000. At 670,000. Another 10 if you wish, Tim, but I'm at 670,000. On my right, against the phone, 670,000. Any more bids at 670,000? Well, you will miss it, Tim, if there's no further bids. 670, fair warning, and going at £670,000. Sure, thank them anyway, at 670. 670 it is. Thank you, lot number 362, lot 362. Well, the Alpha 1900C, one of only 100 1900Cs with Pininfarina coachwork. This beautiful Alpha, professionally restored in 2014 in preparation for the 2015 Mille Amelia and makes for the ideal touring car for historic rallying and events. And again, well, where should we start it? Nice car, very much a collector's car, and already I've got 180,000 offered, 180,000, 180,000. Any advance at 180? 180,000, 190,000 bid. Thank you, at 190, 200. 210, 210, 210, I'm bid, 210, 220, 220. Further back, against you seated, at 220,000, any advance? Thank you anyway, 220, I'm bid, going at 220. Are we done? 220. At 220, well, you will miss it, madam, 220,000. Are we done? 220, fair warning. And that's a pass, 220, that's a pass. Moving on to lot number 363, 363. Well, ladies and gentlemen, the Bentley R-Type Continental Fastback boasts exquisite lines and indeed is rapid, but effortless touring ability. Was the fastest four-seater in its day. This example has been in the same family ownership uh, since 1960 and been a familiar sight on Bentley Drivers Club events. Running and driving well, delightfully patinated example. Still retains its original leather interior. There it is, showing on my right. Matching chassis and engine. Just coming through. Thanks ever so much. What do you think, Richard? Bit of you? 300,000 for it? 300,000? 300,000. 300 bid. Thanks, Richard. At 300. The wrong Richard. At 300,000. At 300, it's Richard B against Richard C. 
at 300, in advance, at 300,000, 320,000, 350,000, 380,000, 380,000, with the other Richard, at 380,000, going at 380,000, in advance, at 380,000, are we done, at 380,000, 90? No, 380,000 I'm bid at 380. In advance, take 10 if you like, but I'm at 380. 390. 390 I'm bid at 390,000. Any more bids at 390? Who will round it to 40? But I'm at 390 now. Take another 10. I'm at 390,000. The R-Type Continental Fastback. One of the great collector's cars. There it is, 390. Any more bids at 390? 390, not quite there, we're moving on. And lot number, 364. Well, lovely turbo here. Restored this year, full service history, with all mileage documented, finished in that wonderful Venetian blue. There it is. If you want a turbo, look no further than the example offered here. Lovely example. And already interest coming through at 60,000. I have at 60, 60,000, 60,000. Any advance on 60, 65, 70. Still with me at 70. My absentee at 70,000, 70,000, 75,000. I'm out with you. The bid's in the room. My book is clear at 75,000. Next is 80. I'm at 75. The Porsche Turbo at 75,000. I'm out 75,000. Bids with you, sir, at 75. Any advance on 75? 80,000, new bid. 80,000 I have. 80,000. Against you, I'm out. 80,000 we have. Any more bids now at 80,000 and going. Fair warning, all done at 80,000. 80 it is, thank you. Lot number 365, lot 365. Telephone's coming through. Well, as many of you know, I own a Healy 100, and I can honestly say they're supercars to own. They have the looks, but crucially, really good value to run with that Austin mechanicals and running gear. Here's an original right-hand drive BN1 that belongs to a club member I know who knows a lot more about them than me. <laughs> Telephone's coming through. Really, really nice. Healy 100, and again, already I can own the bidding at 30,000. 30,000 I have, but 30,000, 30,000, 30,000, 32,000, good to see you, 32,000, 32, 35, 35, 38,000, selling the car, going to be sold, 38,000, car is on sale at 38,000, at 38,000, 40,000, 40,000, Healy 100, selling at 40, it's good value at that, we sold a tatty one at Goodwood members meeting for 30 something, didn't we? Do you remember that? 40,000. Take another two. It's on the telephone. 40,000. Take another two. No. No, I'll get you in the club. <laughs> Not that way. Um, but uh, 40,000 then on the telephone at 40,000. It's here and it's selling. The Healy 100. Delightful little car. Any more bids then at 40,000? Are you sure at the back? Do you want one? Do you want 41? Yes, 41, 41, 41. There you go, if in doubt, bid. That's my motto, 41. 42. Take another one. It might work, we don't know unless we try. Sure. <laughs> well, you gave it a go. 43, 45, 46, 48, 48. Tactical bidding, telephone versus telephone, 48,000.
49 or 50, I don't mind, but I'm at 48,000 with the other telephone. With the other, 50,000. 50,000. The Healy 100. BN1. 52. 52. You tell me, Richard, I don't mind, but at 52, Sholto's bid. Sholto's telephone bidder has it at the moment. 52,000. 53,000. Fifty-three thousand. Fifty-five. At fifty-five thousand. Fifty-seven. Fifty-seven. No more. At 57,000, your bit of Richard. Take another one. Take another one. If in doubt, bid. They're not in doubt. At 57,000 then, Richard, your bid up at 57,000. Well done, Mike. 57,000. Sold at 57. 51, 23. Thank you. And moving on to lot number 366. 366, the Julia 1600 Spider. I can't read that. Watch me. Got it. Okay, lot 366. Late bids coming through. 366, the Alpha Julia 1600. Now, if I were to trade my Healy for another car, I'd be very tempted with one of these Julia Spiders. Lively twin cam engine. Sublime looks to match. Reverse gear will need attention, but you only want to go forward with these, ladies and gentlemen. And uh, where should we start it? Where should we start it? 20,000 pounds, that seems good value for this, doesn't it? 20,000, I can't believe it. 20,000, what do you think? 20,000, you bidding? 20,000, bid, thank you. 20,000, 20,000 bid, 20,000. Any advance on 20? Opening bid at 20,000, 22,000. 22 I have at 22,000 is bid. Any more bids at 22,000 pounds and going at 22, 25, 25, 28. 28 I'm bid at 28,000. This still seems great value. 28,000, any advance? The Julia 1600 Spider, 28,000. Take another one, take another two, I don't mind. Otherwise we'll call it now, 28 then and going. Are we done? We are, thank you, 28,000. Moving on to lot number 367. Lot 367. Well, here we are for the mighty Lister Storm. One of only six of these spectacular GTM cars were built. Uh, built in uh, 2001, the car, this car, was a factory entry for three seasons and several podium places including winning the 2003 Anders Torp race and achieving second place overall in that year's FIA GT Championship. Restored in the mid-2000s, last used here at the Goodwood Festival of Speed in 2008, where it proved immensely popular. And uh, with the contemporary Ferrari 550 and 575 GT1s at eye-watering prices today, this nearest thing to a works Jaguar Lister Storm GT1 represents a rare opportunity to acquire a front-running big banger at realistic prices. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. There it is. And again, 300,000, 300,000 for the Lister at 300,000. Any advance on three? Three I have at 300,000, 320,000, yes. Thank you, bid. 320 I have at 320,000 and going at 320, 320, 340. 340, 360, 360, it's against you, 380, 380,000. Well, now it's against you, 380,000. On my right, it's against you, 380,000. There's the price, 
You know what it is in euros, 380,000. Any advance? 380,000. Any more bids? Three, 390 bid, 390,000. 390,000. 390. 390. 400. 400. Back in the room against the phone. 400,000. Any advance? 400,000. Any more bids? 400,000. Well, it's with you in the room, against you on the phone, 400,000. Take another 10, 20, or 50, I don't mind. 400,000. 400,000. Any advance at 400,000. Are we done? At 400,000, well, it's against the telephone. 405,000. Four hundred and five thousand on the phone. Ten is next if you wish, but I'm at four hundred and five. Four hundred and five. At four hundred and five thousand. Four hundred and five thousand. 405,000 pounds. Are we all done? Yep. At 405. Fair warning. Looks like it's yours, Rob. I'm going. 405 it is. Thank you. Great. Thank you. Number? 5163. Thank you. And on to lot number 368, lot 368, the 330 GT 2 plus 2. When you think about it, these 1960s V12 Berlinas are tremendous value. Four up, 1960s Ferrari motoring at this price makes a lot of sense. Continuous history and low mileage as well. And uh, where should we start it? 100,000 for it? 100,000? 100,000? Thank you. Good to see you at 100,000. Any advance at 100,000. Going at 100. Any advance. 110,000 bid. Thank you. 110. 110. Nearer me at 110,000. Online you are fluttering. 110,000. 110,000. In the room against you online. 120,000. Thank you. You're in. Online are in at 120,000. 120,000. Online has it at 120. Any advance now? Any advance at 120,000? Well, it is remarkable value at that, isn't it? 120,000. Currently with you online at 120,000. 130,000. Now it's against you online. 130,000 is bid. Back in the room against you online. 130,000. 1960s Ferrari motoring V12. 130,000. Any more online? Otherwise, you'll miss it. 130, I'm bid. Going at 130, then. Any more bids at 130,000? Are you sure? You are. 130,000. Thank you. Got it. Lot 369. Well, sticking to the Italian theme, it's Flaminia time. Flaminia time. Typical great styling from Turing on the two and a half litre Flaminia, extensively restored by Thornley Kellum, the UK's premier Lancia specialists. Disc brake example, so it will stop as well as it goes. Telephones are coming through, uh, telephones through, and again, starting the bidding at 60,000, we hand 60,000. The Flaminia convertible at 60,000, 60,000, 60 bid, thank you, at 60. 60,000. It's against you, Justin, at 60,000. 65,000. You're in at 65,000. The Flaminia at 65,000. That's your bid. 65. Your bid at 65. 70,000. Against you. 70,000. It's against you. Nearer me at 70. 70,000. 75,000. 75,000. 
at 75,000. Further back, against you nearer me at 75,000. Well, it's your bid f further back standing against you seated, 75,000. Any more bids at 75,000? Are we done? We all out, Malcolm? At 80,000 online. 80,000 online bidder at 80,000. At 80,000 online, you've got it against the room at 80,000. Any more bids at 80,000? We're here, we're selling at 80,000 pounds and going all done at 80,000. 51, 52 at 80,000. Well done indeed. And on to lot number 370. Well, we've got a couple of phones coming through. Rare car, even rare in right-hand drive, owned since 1992 with only occasional use, otherwise cosseted in a private dehumidified uh, museum. And ladies and gentlemen, I've got two telephones coming through. Lots of interest, much viewed. I'm going to open the bidding at £10,000 at 10, 11, 12, 13. Shout the bids out then. 13. Any more bids at 13? 14. Good to see you, Justin. 15. 15. 15. Here at 15. Well, any more bids at 15? 16. 16. Going at 16. Any more bids? 16. 17. 17, I've got. 17. 18. 18. Any advance on 18,000? Any more bids? 18,000, 18, 19, 20, 20,000. Well, your bidder, John, 20,000. Selling all the way. Any more bids at 20? Are we all done at 20,000? Sold, 20,000. Lovely, thank you. Lot number 371. Yeah, that keeps uh, going. So lot 371, it's the shadow. Everyone loves the shadow sort of thing, the sort of city financiers should have, I would have thought, a nice shadow. There it is. Look very nice floating around St. Paul's, wouldn't it? And uh, where should we start it, ladies and gentlemen? Where should we start it? 4,000 pounds bid? No, Richard, 4,000 bid. I have already bidding 1,000 at Goodwood. How very dare you? 4,000, 5,000, good to see you, sir. 5,000, 6,000 I've got, 6,000, 6,000. It's selling all the way, it's no reserve, 6,000. Any more bids at 6,000, 6,000 pounds. Any more bids, got to sell it. It's the shadow. Owen, six, six, five, six, five, why not? Six, five, I've got, six, five, six, five. Any advance on six, five? Seven, 7,000 I've got at 7,000. Seven five. But there's three of you on it now. Seven five, I've got. Seven five. Has to be sold. Another 500, sir. Driven to the sale from Chichester. 8,000. 8,000. I joke. How far was it, Malcolm? It was Chichester. 8,000. There you go. All the way from Chichester. Is there another Chichester in England? No, that's the, that, that's the one then. £8,000. Well, I'm sure it'll get you back there, sir. At £8,000 is bid. Going at 8000 Any more bids at 8000 Oh, 85. 8.5. I wouldn't let them get away with that, sir. Nine. It's a shadow. Oh, it's a Rolls Royce shadow. Yeah, no sure? Well, at 8.5, with the telephone, £8,500. Fair warning and going 8.5. Rob, your bid up. 5.162. Lot number 3.72. Well, I've been looking at this car, I must say. These are, these are the cars of the future, aren't they? The Audi Quattro, offered with a new MOT, the Quattro. And I remember seeing this car at the RAC in the uh, Pergola. Thought it looked fantastic there. It's known to us. We sold it about 10 years ago. This would look nice around St. Paul's, wouldn't it? 
And uh, what should we say? What should we say? Seven, 7,000, 7,000, let's get going. Seven, bid, thank you. Seven, eight, nine. Fire up the quattro, Malcolm. 10, 10, 11, new bidder. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. 18,000, nearer me seated at 18,000. In advance, 19 online. 19, online has it. Any more? 20. 20, there's so much interest. 20,000. 20,000. Telephone has it at 20. 20,000. Any more bids? 22. 22 online. You have it online against the telephone. 22,000. 24,000. Going up in twos, Navy. 24,000. 24,000, telephone against you online, 24,000. Any more bids? It's magnificent, it's a magnificent, 20, 25, 25, can they do that? Well, they've learned how to do it, 25,000 online. 25, well played, 25. 25,000 online has it, <laughs> they've hacked into the system. 25,000, with you online. Paddle 5044, selling the car, 25,000 and going. 25, congratulations online, 5044. Got yourself a nice quattro, well played. Lot number 373. Well, 373, this is good value. This is the Jaguar E-Type Series 3 Coupe. Manual gearbox. Manual gearbox, that's the one you want. And coming from long-term ownership since 1989. Occasional use since otherwise been displayed and care for in the house. And again, let's get it sold. 18, 19, 20,000 I can say. 20,000. That's cheap E-type motoring, isn't it? 20,000. 20,000. 22. 25. 28. 28,000. Buy the pillow at 28,000. Any advance on 28,000. Any more bids at 28,000? We're here, we're selling. 29, 29. 29. No, 29,000 with your bid of Malcolm at 29,000. At 29,000. At 29,000. Any advance on 29? Round it up to 30, sir. Manual gearbox. Coupe motoring at 20. 29,000. Any more bids at 29,000? All done. Five, three, one. Well played. 29,000. And lot number 374. Well, it's the Vale. It's the Vale. Now, so we'll notice, please note, Mr. Morgan owned two Vale sports uh, specials uh, in 1934, and he competed on the Monte Carlo rally in the sister car, not this one. So there you go. So uh, taking its name from the Maida Vale district where the company was based, this little Vale underwent restoration in the 1990s. Cracking condition, another rare car for you today. And again, I already have 22, 24,000, 24,000, 24,000, 26,000. Your bid, 26, 28,000. 28 I have at 28,000. Going at 28, going at 28. Any advance on 28,000? Fair warning, 28 I'm bid for the veil. For the veil, find me another 28,000. All done. 28 it is, thank you. And uh, moving on to lot 375. Well, it's the, uh, the ambulance, the uh, Volkswagen Type 2 ambulance, 1962. And uh, one of nine built uh, for the UK market, presenting its original colour scheme, albeit it's been repainted, we're told it drives well. Rare historic vehicle, suitable of events, or for showing, or touring. Stretcher is included, ladies and gentlemen. It comes with its stretcher. Good to see you, Dexter. How are you? All right. How's that knee? Better. Good. Okay, so it's the Volkswagen Type 2 Ambulance. And uh, who needs an ambulance, Jonathan? 
20,000, 20,000, 20,000 bid. Thank you at 20,000. You never know when you might need one. 20,000, at 20,000. And if Brexit comes along, forget the NHS, you'll need one of these. 22,000, 22,000, 24, 24, 26, 26,000. Any advance on 26,000, going at 26, 26, any advance. Well, that looks good value at that. A lot of fun. Great at Goodwood Revival. Taken on tours and rallies. At £26,000. Any advance? 27. 28. 28. 29. 29. 29,000 bid. Round it up to 30 if you like. But I'm at 29,000 pounds. Any more bids? 29,000 pounds. Any more bids? All done, 29. We are, thank you, 29,000. And uh, lot number 376. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I said we had a broad spectrum of cars. From Type 2 Ambulance to the Lamborghini Aventador. There it is, showing for you there. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, stunning limited edition of Entador, the Lamborghini's flagship model, Mura Homage, one of only 50 made and believed to be one of only six in right-hand drive. So it's got rarity on its side. Unregistered, unused, UK VAT, fully paid. A brand new Lamborghini offered here at Goodwood today. So ladies and gentlemen, another car here to sell and we can open the bidding at 140,000 pounds for the event to door. 140,000, 140,000, 150,000. Thank you bid, 150, 160, 160, 160 bid, 170, 170,000. Going at 170, any more bids at 170,000. I can't believe it, that is great value, 170,000. 170, 180, thank you bid, your bid, 180,000. You have it. You have it, 180,000. 190, you did have it at 190. At 190,000. Well, it's against you, sir. 190,000, so close. Take five if you like, but I'm at 190,000. Letting it go, 190,000. Take five if you like. Otherwise, we'll let it go. 190,000, all done. Fair warning for the Aventador. 190 it is, and let it go. Lot number 377. Well, we're in the uh, modern era high-powered section of the catalogue, the V600. Well, how about this for box ticking? This Vantage had the V600 upgrade in 2007, which cost over 80,000 pounds at the time. Comes with the manual box, has covered a little over 10,000 miles from new. Full service history. Most recently, a year ago, with Aston Martin uh, works, and it's the perfect colour. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, it's the V600 Vantage. Look good in Hertfordshire, I would reckon. And where should we start it? 180,000 for it. 180,000. 180,000. Good seeing it. 180,000. 180,000. 190,000 bid. 190. 190. I've got. 200, 200 is bid, going at two, going at two, take another 10, 210, keep it in tens, keep it in tens, 220,000, 220 I have at 220, on my left, 220,000, going at 220, any more bids at 220, 230, back in, 230, two, yes, 235, 235, it's 5,000 increments now, 235. Take another five if you like, but I've got 235 bid at 235. Are we done? 235, going at 235. Can't believe it, there you go, 235. 235 it is. I do have a word with this afterwards, Nick. Lot number 378, it's the uh, 220S Ponton, there it is. 
Well, we sold the Cabriolet earlier today. Now the coupe, one left-hand drive example, benefited from recent uh, expenditure. And again, and again, got some interest coming through. I've got 22,000, 22, 22, 22, 25, 25,000, 28, 30, 30,000 I'm bid at 30,000. Is bid at 30,000. Any advance on 30? 30,000 is bid. Any more bids now at 30? The left hand drive pont on at 30,000. Any more? At 30,000. Well, the car is on sale at 30. Going to be sold online if you're following. The car is selling at 30,000. Are we done then at 30,000? All done. 30. 30 it is. Well played. 5090 at 30,000. Lot number 379. 379. Well, the Ferrari now. We've got the 328 GTS, another car that both presents and reads well. Rare right hand drive, UK supplied car. Only four owners from new. Circa 12,000 miles as well from new. And again, where should we start it? Where should we start it? 38,000, I already have at 38,000. 38,000, good to see you, Peter. At 38, 40, 40, I have at 40,000. 40,000, 42. 42, I've taken just before you online. In the room at 42,000. 45, if you want to have a go online. 45, you do at 45,000. 45, online has it against you in the room. You've got it online, but it's against the room. 48,000, now it's against you. 48, in the room at 48,000. Going at 48,000. Any advance on 48,000. It's against you online. 50,000, you're coming in. Thank you at 50,000 bid. At 50,000 is bid. At 50,000, any advance. Any advance. It's against you in the room. Online has it at 50,000. Take a small one if you like. We'll keep it small, I don't mind. At 50,000. At 50,000. Any advance on 50 at 50,000. Telephone's waiting as well at 50,000. Take two. 52,000. 52. 55 if you like online. I'm at 52 in the room. 52,000. Any advance. Telephones if you like. Online if you like. You have it at the moment in the room at 52,000. Going at 52,000. Any more bids now? 52,000. 55,000 bid online. Online has it. Desmond, good to see you. Good to see you. We started about three hours ago, but good to see you nonetheless. At 55,000, online has it. Any advance? Online has it. Any more bids against you in the room? At 55,000, looks like it's yours online. They're saying no more. In the room then and going. Online, congratulations, that's 738 at 55,000. And moving on to lot number 380 now. Well, centenary year for Bentley, of course. Originally bodied as a tourer by Van den Pla and benefiting from a recent engine rebuild, this example on its desirable sporting short chassis coupled with elegant open tourer coachwork is the most desirable specification what better way to celebrate 100 years of Bentley than to own this car built during the period of dominance uh, by Bentley at Le Mans? Well, ladies and gentlemen, and again, where should we start it? Where should we start it? At 260,000 pounds. We have 260,000. The Bentley 3 litre, the speed model at 260,000. 260, 280 I have at 280,000. 300,000. 300,000. 300,000, 320,000. At 320,000. Well, it's against you near me at 320,000. Going at 320,000. Any more bids at 320,000. Take another bid. Take another bid. 320. Are we done? No more? Well, we'll pass that. 320,000. And on to lot number 381. Lot 381, well, ladies and gentlemen, it's been well viewed. 
We sold one of these last year. Very popular car. We sold one very well last year. First appearing in metallic grey guys in the 2012 Bond movie Skyfall before being upgraded by Land Rover Special Vehicle Operations to make one of the 10 SVX Spectre editions. The Bigfoot offered today is the only Land Rover to have ever been used in two consecutive Bond film, Skyfall and, of course, Spectre. Telephones coming through. Interest as well. I can open the bidding already at £140,000. £140,000. £140,000. Any advance at one forty? One fifty. thank you, bid. £150,000. That's your bid. That's your Land Rover, your Spectre Land Rover. 150,000, 160,000, 160 bid, 160, 170, 170,000 I've got, 170,000, 170, here it is, 175, 175, why not, selling all the way, selling the car, 175, any more bids at 175, are we done, 180, 180 bid, 180, 180, 185, 185, 190, 200, 200. Go up in tens, I think, if we can. Go up in tens, do that for the online. 200, 210, 210, I'm bid. 225, 225, 250, if you like, Tim. 225, how are you getting on down there, Navy? All right, 225. 230, 230. 250, tactical bidding, 250,000, 250,000. 250,000 bid. Any advance, it's the only car to appear in two consecutive Bond films. Skyfall and Spectre. That makes it unique among the others. 250,000. Any more bids? Are we done? 260. 275. 275. 275. Try 280 if you like, Tim. No more? Well, thank them anyway. £275,000. Any more bids at 275 Here and selling. Well played. 5134. 275000 Thank you, Rupert. Lot number 382. 382, the Toyota, the Formula One. A rare big budget Formula One car from the 3 litre V10 era, one of 11 chassis built during the 2004 season, where it was, we are told, used for testing and or display purposes. Offered as a display car, it was purchased direct from the Toyota team by the vendor. What an excellent provenance it's got. Ladies and gentlemen, where do we start it? 50,000 already. We have interest. 50, I have at 50,000. 50, 50, 55. 60. Selling the car at 60,000. Any advance at 60,000. Any more bids? Selling the Toyota. Any more bids then at 60,000. We're here and selling and sold. 60,000 it is. 50,32 at 60,000. Thank you. Lot number 383. It's the Bentley Arnage. It's the Red Label Sports Saloon. Maybe this around St. Paul's 2000, Red Label Sports Saloon. For that growing family as well. Putney, Sheen, anywhere it will look good. What do you think? Yep, Richmond even. Circa 24,000 miles from new with full service history. Well cared for example, immaculate both inside and out. Very much collectible modern era Bentley. And again, already I've got 18, 19,000 off of it. 19,000, 19,000, 20,000, 21, 
Keeping it in ones, 21, 22. 22,000 at 22,000 bid. Any advance on 22,000. The red label, the Arnage at 22,000. Any more bids at 22,000. Seems good at that, doesn't it? Seems good value, 23, 24. 24, I'm bid now at 24,000. Going at 24. 24,000. Any more bids? 24,000. Fair warning and going. 24 it is. Not quite there. Do have a word with us. Lot number 384. Well, the DB5 now. Well, we've sold the last three we've offered. Lovely DB5 finished in the iconic James Bond colours of silver birch and black. Fully restored by the mark specialists RS Williams in 1999 which consisted of upgraded uh, engine to 4.7 litres, bare metal respray and various RS Williams upgrades. Ready to go, lovely condition. Where shall we start? Where should we start? 480,000 pounds, 480,000. 480,000. Cheap at half the price, 480,000. 480 bid, thank you. 480 we have, is bid at 480,000. Any advance, 480,000. 480, 500,000. Your bid, 500, 520, 520, 550. It's the only DB5 today, sir. 550, 580. 580, I have at 580. 600 bid, 600. 600 bid, 600,000. Well, at 600, your bid against you. 600,000, I have. For the DB5, any advance at 600, 620. I wouldn't let him get away with that, sir. 620,000. 630. 630. Keep it in 10, sir, if you wish. 630,000. 640,000. 640,000. Are we done? 640. Thank you anyway. 640,000 then. Any more bids at 640,000 we have? All done. 640 it is. Thank you. Moving on to lot number 385. Just a couple more cars to go, lot 385, it's the 308 GTS, we had the 328 earlier on, again a UK car with low mileage, this time just 15,000 miles or so, and offered with a correct set of luggage as well, it comes with luggage, so what should we say for it ladies and gentlemen, what should we say, again 60,000, let's get going, 60,000 for it at 60, 60, 65,000, thank you bid, 65, 70, 70 I've got. 70,000, 70,000, your bid at 70, any more bids at 70,000, any more bids, take another five, take another five, 70,000, are we done, are we done then at 70,000, we are, thank you, and ladies and gentlemen, the last lot, no it's not, the penultimate lot today. There was a Mercedes-Benz hiding before the Espada. The Mercedes-Benz, it's the SL65 2009 car. One of only 12 UK delivered and only the second right-hand drive example to come to market, in, well, auction market, in the past five years. It's the Black Series, offers a rare opportunity to acquire one of these highly sought-after limited edition supercars. Well, it's the SL65 that's one hell of a car, ladies and gentlemen. £100,000 I already have at £100,000. Any advance at £100,000. 100, 110 online. Thank you, bid. 110, 120, 120,000. 130, 130, 130. With you online. 140, back in the room at 140. 140, I'm bid at 140,000. Going at 140. Your bid against you online. 140. Any more bids at 140,000? Going at 140,000. 150 I've taken in the room. 
150 I've taken in the room just before one line came through. Yours in the room at 150. Yours in the room, if you like, at 150. Any advance at 150,000. Any more bids at 150,000 is bid. Take five online. We'll take five online. It's with you on the back row. Well, they come in at 160. 160. Now it's against you, sir. Online has it. No, where are we? 155. One, because you changed it. 155 online. It's selling all the way, sir. 157.5? Yeah, 157.5. Thank you. 157.5. One, Navy, how are you doing with the keyboard down there? 157.5 in the room. 160 if you like it online. It's 157.5 in the room against you online. Next one's a little one online if you want it. 157.500. The lot, the car is selling. Online, you've gone quiet on me. I thought you might want to have a go. Otherwise, I'm selling it. Sorry? It's 1575 in the room. Well, let's unfreeze the system. It's showing at 155. That's why you're panicking online. We'll, uh, we'll see what's happening. Bear with me in the room, sir. The system's frozen. Can't cope with these 500 pound little increments. One fifty-seven five in the room. There we go. One sixty straight back, sir. One sixty. Oh, don't give up. You sure? It's a long walk back to the car, sir. Take two five. No, I'm only trying to help you, sir. I'm here to help. 160. Online has it. 160,000. It will be sold. It will be sold at 160,000. Are you sure, sir? Okay. You're sure, madam? Good. Excellent. You're both sure. That's what we need. 160,000. Online looks like it's yours then. You got it. 5124 160. 5124. And uh, we'll have to find you another one if we can, sir. And the last lot today, the Espada. The Espada. And again, uh, Marcello Gandini designed the Espada for Batoni in response to Lamborghini wanting a four seater to complement their two seaters. Received a positive uh, acclaim by the motoring press. Great example to finish off the sale. An original UK-supplied right-hand drive car with manual tr transmission and some restoration work too. And I've already got 50,000 for it. 50,000. 55,000. 55, I'm bid at 55. 55. 60. 65. Selling all the way at 65,000. Good to see you. At 65,000. At 65,000. Selling the car. Selling the Espada. Last lot today. Any more bids at 65,000. Sold at 65,000 to 368 at 65. Ladies and gentlemen, it's been a lovely sale. Have a wonderful weekend. And we look forward to seeing you back at Revival or indeed Bewley. Thank you.